sorry for the hold up. It's about time to hop on. Let's see what happens with all this. Hmm. Got some dailies to do, gotta get some artifacts. We'll be chilling. And as of right now, should be alright for our dailies. And this is. Oh, we gotta go up here. Pregnant defense might suck. Depending on. The Hydra ones are really good at destroying the monolith. That's kind of the issue. Oh, whatever. Because Kida will be out soon. Question is, Emily, she'll take a bit longer. So for a while, it'll be her, Teenage Milani, and Kachina, and that would be kind of goofy. Eh, we'll see what happens. That's a... Oh, we got some more warriors over there, it seems. That's nice. I think... It's actually... Hello! Good to see you. How are you doing? I did not mean to do that. One, two, okay. Just getting started on some dailies and all. Don't need that full guest in at the moment. Hmm. Uh, these guys should be... Well, it seems to be most the most we can hope for most of the time. Okay. Right. Okay. Decent enough. Bite. Bite serpent. Bite and... Uh huh. New scratches. It's a little worrying. Oh right, because we got a we'll get sitting in there. Okay. Yeah, and this is much, much better. Okay. Cool. Turn that down. I didn't mean to do it like that. Okay. Hit. Pull up. Yeah, this is just so much better. Come on. Right. Hop off. Is this? Thank you, and ooh, huh. Switch to Melania then. All about triggering reactions with Night Soul stuff to get her a decent buff. But when I used this uh, yesterday, it, there was one with a bunch of the Hydra Warriors, and they were really good at just destroying the Metalists. It was kind of vile, actually. Okay. I'll use that mushroom. Right. Uh, they real. I really need more of the whistles. These guys drop. It is what it is. Okay, cool. That did work. Grab some of these mushrooms for a bit more fulgistin. Oh, oh. Yeah. You like that word a lot, face plant. Have you considered turning your face into a plant? Hmm. It's much, much better. Some ruins and just a little flaunting. Volatile Travel Warriors, Time Travel Challenge. What do you what do you mean by that? It's already a plant? Are you trying to call yourself ugly or something again? Don't do that. Okay. It's done. And, okay, that might work. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Okay, and get some of that nice little back. And, group of this. It's hard to determine how best to handle her abilities, honestly. Okay, let's go for a hit. It, yes? I have to sometimes. Okay, let's go for a couple more hits, and what kind of warriors are here now? Even at higher levels, this isn't too bad. I, again, did not mean to do that. Triggering the natural transmission is easy to do unintentionally. It's kind of annoying, honestly. Okay, I gotta wait till we get three. Go away, okay, nice. Check for this, and thanks. This is actually not all that bad. Not amazing, but okay. Right. Mm. Her damage is quite good, and she's not even fully leveled, and nowhere near fully talented. 
It's just... I gave her a decent artifact set that match to get through basically dumb luck. Okay. Just trying to see... When is the full event on Rock is my question. Check events. What is Frosty? I don't know what that is. Oh, oh, the Twitch thing. The Twitch thing that you were told about. But is it better for your connection, at least? I hope, right? Okay, traces of artistry and... Oh, okay, so the final phase starts tomorrow. So we can actually do the event tomorrow. I think that's probably a better idea, too. That's frightening. Speed forward, full light orbs, full light targets. Oh, it's a spirit way challenge. Oh, that's really cool. Fair. I forgot it existed until you mentioned it. But there was another challenge in the open world. A challenge like this, which was really, really cool. Challenge score, increased progress. Okay. Bite that. You can ride that with a dragon, or you can just ride it with Milani, which is really cool. Yes? Does that make you mad for some reason? I feel like the answer is probably yes. Okay. Shulanen? Oh, we can keep going even though we've already beaten it until the end of Spirit Way. That's actually really funny. And our score would go down if we hit the rift. Very Italian of you. Okay, so you basically have to get two-thirds of the ones on here. Okay. Then there's one up here, but to get there... This will approach from this way, because I didn't know this waypoint was even here. Emergency Avatar of Lava. Hmm. I wonder if that's the one that has Pyro on it all the time, or the one that we need to buy Pyro to. And oh, there was a common chest here? Yeah, I don't think I killed anything. I think that was just sort of... Somewhat hidden. I feel like a lot of things feel like Mario Kart to you. Just a lot of smoke on this hill. And that over there is presumably the Animo Quans area where Chaska is, according to some weak slash speculation. Mario Kart fanatic. It's a crime. We're going to convict you of it. Ouch. That... Italy really is a tragic place, huh? Feel as if... You can still be a Mario Kart fanatic without having played it. There are lots of fake fans in this world. Okay. So, another teleport waypoint right over there. Cool. Kachina car. And there's our avatar. Okay. So does that mean you aren't a fan at all? Or what are you implying here? You're a real Mario Kart fan? Okay, so these are the ones that you want to apply a bunch of pyro to. Roaming avatar of lava amidst the mountains of Born. Okay. Come on. Oh, we got hit. Oh, that's Geo damage. So it's sort of Pyro Geo. Ouch. That's a bit much, don't you think? Okay, well. Come on. And. Two, three, fight. Oh, this is gonna be a bit much. Fight. One, two, three, fight. It's got good. Stance, kinda. Fly. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's use that. Boost that, and there we are. Two. Fly. Yep, we got the good damage bonus from Kachina's artifact set. Instant noodles are saving for family launch? Family launch, instant noodle saving. Huh. Oh, come on. Fair enough. And, uh, but they try to make the Night Soul Burst easy to manage by, I mean, Night Soul Transmission easy to manage by giving you a bit of leeway. Sort of, you can activate it 
in dash mode, even when you're stopping a dash. But that just means... If I don't want to use that Night Soul Transmission, I'm going to use Night Soul Transmission to get a little bit more time out of a specific skill. I have to sort of wait for a cooldown, or maybe just switch to a non-not one character. That... That makes me a little sad, actually. Because he's eating good food, and you're just eating instant noodles. I feel like... You're hurting yourself for no real reason there. Unless you really just like instant noodles that much. Okay. Rare instant noodles? Is there a super rare too? Is this instant noodle gasha or something? Okay. Well... How many artifacts do I have that I could try strongboxing? Fair. Oh, okay. So it's not just a poverty meal. Okay, that's good. How many can I trash? A lot of things I need to trash right now, honestly. Oh, well. I can clear out a little bit of space. Feed it to Sethos. Hmm. Oh, okay. Uh, honestly, if they don't- if they're the only things that don't make you sick, maybe they should- maybe you should eat them more. I-I mean that. Also, apparently, you've probably heard this already and decided you would prefer to just accept constant pain. But... I have heard that apparently avoiding carbs helps mitigate the symptoms of PCOS. Okay, Sappho emits the waves. Shattering ice. Northwest from blazing ruins. Not aggressive unless shoot or the wildlife are attacked. So it might be she might be in there maybe? There's a local legend around this area. Yeah. But it's just sort of... I think that's kind of a non-starter for Italians. Okay. So she over there... Can definitely get a lot of mats from taking her down as the only in-world. Warrior local legend, I think. I... <laughs> I feel like to a certain extent... Okay. Well, there, there are lots of low-carb things. And I can't exactly claim to be immune to it, but it... Yeah. Not much. Well. Oh, there's a book right there. She's not aggressive unless the animals are attacked. Hi there. Hello. Unfinished musical score. A seemingly incomplete musical composition stuck within the notebook. Following is written below. Thanks for suggestions. After making the adjustments, the musical inflections have indeed become more vivacious. Haven't even met again since the last pilgrimage of the return of the Sacred Flame, have we? Sam wants to drink some fruit wine and dram off with some new songs. By that time, I suppose we'll be done with this one. And if you attack one of the animals, she also aggroes. Yep. Sappho emits the waves. Waterborne Wootenis. Oh, okay. And... Two, three... And oh, but... I messed this up. I messed this up. Because Yai has the wrong Witsith. Oh, like a... Like a true gamer. Fair enough. Okay, but this local legend should draw me a lot of stuff. To use to level Milani and Kachina, so I'll do that. Also, Arlequino needs a bit more health. From Beta? 
In beta, she was legitimately stronger than New Viet. By a pretty big margin. That's... She's still good, but she's a side grade with more of a single target focus instead of just being unambiguously better. A lot of people got mad about that, about it, because it was also last patch that New Viet was... They changed his turn speed. Well, wh what do you mean? That they nerfed her or that they power crapped New Viet within a year of his release? Okay. Cool. <laughs> Actually, keep knocking around unless. Uh, God damn. Overlords. Why? It was good for game balance. Okay, one, two, three, and. Uh, around there, and shoot. Come on. Three, four. One, two, three, four. Well. Don't you like New Viet too? It, quite frankly, it was one of the most credent things about the idea that, oh, they're basically nerfing all male characters and attempting to phase them out. I, oh, shit. Fucking hell. Pressed the wrong button and Fischl fucking died. So. You should be able to use food from the character menu. What? What is? Okay, I need... A few more particles. Uh... uh. Family's out of town, and it's up to me to- I'm the only one who can take care of the animals right now, which really sucks. I had to ask my dad, what do I do if the dog dies? If the dog dies while you're gone, what do I do? And he was just- just call me, and I, well, I was like, yeah, of course I was gonna call you, but what to do in the meantime? Uh, it, I can't even take a nap anymore. Because if you ignore the dog for five minutes, he just takes a big fat shit all over the floor. And I've basically acknowledged getting on for this long. I thought about not streaming today just to avoid any chance of the dog doing things. And I was just sort of, there's only so much I can let that stupid dog rule my life. But, uh, come on. Yes, there we are. What? Knocking her around or how did I get up on there? I did not want to get on that stupid tent string. God damn. It it's what happens these days. It's part of why I hate the dog so much. Because it completely rules my life. Okay. And I mean this when I say it. It's part of why I'm legitimately very resentful for my sister a lot of the time. Because they got the dog. Despite me very much not being a dog person. Basically just because she wanted a dog. Okay, is she gonna take any damage from that? Oh. Alright. So, she's just gone. And aggroed. You know, I, asked, uh, I had interest in various animals, and you know, nothing was ever done about it. And then my sister and her annoying little friends were all get a dog, get a cat, etc. And yeah, it. <sighs> to be totally honest. Favorite might be a bit strong, but I'd say, in, in a lot of ways, she was pretty undeniably treated better. Which, quite frankly, kind of happy about that, because I wouldn't be able to live the guilt of being the favorite. But it's still very annoying sometimes when I have to clean up in both literal and figurative senses. She got a little less annoying over the past few days. 
I think because she didn't want to end things on too bad of a note, but it's still very annoying. And I oh, the switch fail. Well, it was supposed to, so. Okay, cool. And, oh, come on. And of course, we, uh, what a god-awful attack. He is so much. And, oh, wow. Two, three, and... Fischl does have the unique dishonor of being basically the only character not have a... Oh, hell. Fuck off and kill yourself. Okay, this team is fucking dog shit, especially for this fight. It... Yeah, I did consider just canceling things today because of the stupid fucking dog. Uh... Luckily, I don't have any work stuff until Tuesday. If it was any other time of year, I would consider just strangling the dog myself. And hoping that I could get away with it. Because... Well, that's an exaggeration, of course, but it's just sort of... I have really come to resent the dog. I've had five good experiences with a maximum over the entire course of the family deciding basically, yeah, Ju my sister, our daughter wants a dog. Let's get a dog. You know, no need to listen to anyone else's opinions. We're getting a dog. And... Uh, eat this stupid attack. Okay. Come on. That would actually be good to have in pocket. Just get rid of her. Come on, and uh, the fab. That frocking is annoying. Come on. Come on. Worried about what? Me killing the dog? Okay, well, let's go for that hit. And. Mm -hmm. So we can break that big crowd grenade, and as you saw when I dotted at the end there, when she manages to freeze you, she'll do a big attack with huge extra shatter damage. Very, very crazy. Yeah, it... Well, I wouldn't be able to get away with it for one. So... And, oh, come on. I, let's hit and... Did we... I think we blew it up. Yeah, we did. We blew it up. Good. Okay. And... For suspects? Yeah. I mean, nobody else dislikes the dog that much. It's me. And nobody else. Okay. It... I'm just glad that Hu is actually useful here right now. Okay. And... Oh, okay. And... Hit. Boom. And... So there's- oh, how did- how did you get away? Damn. Big thing is, I should have had Sack Sword instead of, uh, the rest here right now. Oh, come on. Uh, I'm actually having pretty big energy issues in this fight right now. Whatever. Come on, how did I completely miss? Just die already. Okay. Come on, come on, and- okay, well. Break this. What do you mean? That you can't play the game right now because you don't have the specs? Or... Come on. Hit and... Can I... Please. And... Luckily the shield here is helping a lot. There we go. Sappho emits the wave and I think we got every... Single... Achievement there. But this is legitimately a good way to farm Saurian drops. <laughs> That's the funniest part. Okay. Sappho emits the waves. And wait. Without being hit by shattering ice attacks. Oh! Okay, it seems to me that you can only unlock one at a time. So for every single one of these, you have to actually do them in order and fight each one at least three times in order to get the achievements there. Luckily, some of them shouldn't require a respawn. That's still interesting. Okay. All right, then. Well, 
I'm gonna be fighting her many times anyway. Just because... And that's one of the best ways to get the drops from that enemy group. It depends on the dragon. Some of them can. The ones who, for whom swimming is their entire point, they can definitely swim. Okay. So Kachina... Can get a Kachina ascension. Yeah. The Kaholosaurus can swim. Okay. There we go. Can't ascend there yet. Claim one of these. Another blue thing. Mm. So we can get another roll on standard banner. Let's do that real quick. It's 34 right there. Okay. Uh, so nothing. Okay. So in that case, I guess I could go around and take down a few more of those guys. It is interesting that, among other things, the way the local legends work does also kind of confirm that the only enemies that we theoretically actually kill, quote-unquote, would maybe be the Fatuli and Hillatrolls. The Hillatrolls can't die normally. I guess it's really just the Fatuli who we kill, which is kind of crazy. Well, alright. As most human enemies sort of smoke bomb away or vanish, but the Fatuli have a sort of leyline fading animation. Also, if you go into here, saw this last night after I ended stream, after the Capitana Mavlico fight cutscene, if you go there yourself, Paimon comments on how the arena is sort of busted up a little from the fight, which is fun. So... I'm gonna need a lot more of these whistles in order to level up Milani and Kachina. But again, you do get a good amount from taking down that local legend. There are two more story and war local legends, but they're in... Oh, sort of trial dimensions, so... Pretty sure they don't have drops as a result. Well, we don't know yet. What we do know is that the model... The male avatar sword model, that's the tags for Capitano in this version, does not have a face under the mask. That does not necessarily mean he's going to be have the mask on if and when he's playable. The big interesting thing is how, and I'm sure you've heard, that Dittore has a ruin guard eye underneath his mask, which you can only see through data mining and editing. I hope... That Capitano keeps the mask when he's playable, but as good of a sign as it is that he has a player-type model, that does not necessarily mean he will be playable. I hope so, but as much as it sucks to say, there really is no way to know. Yeah, I don't imagine they change that, especially since... They haven't shown it yet. So this is Kinich's place. Very adventurous. Oh, that's Chaska. Like us. So we could do some grappling up. Not the type of enjoy danger. So you're saying that you're gonna shoot up Mahoyo HQ? Thrill Seekers, Rock Hunt, Repelling Volcano Parkour. They are also in the Adventurers Guild. Mm -hmm. Bungie jumping out of rope, you just sort of catch them at a time, so that would be interesting. In... Kiyomiwaruka. Different from usual adventurers. A little different, not doing anything. She from the sideline. Well, you're five foot nothing. I don't think you're taking down a single security guard. Suffice it to say, multiple. You would need some sort of force multiplier. Yes? 
just being realistic here. I mean, get real. All they would have to do is just pick you up by your shoulders and throw you out the front door. What is interesting is that I'm pretty sure you can actually talk to some of the Saurians if you're in Saurian form yourself. Yes, that does not change the fact that fighting someone a foot taller than you with twice your mass, that, that's not happening. There are reason that weight classes exist in every single combat sport. Trouble Chief, let's head over to him. To tell you the truth, and I'm sure people have told you this already, but aside from MMA, Being able to do a martial art, quote-unquote, is different from being able to fight. Because martial arts have rules. Yes, but a security guard who is presumably also going to be armed. Okay, good, good luck. Good luck taking down someone twice your size. Good luck taking down someone twice your size with a gun. Or at least some kind of weapon as an unarmed individual. You are not an action movie hero. You are not Jackie Chan. You are not Bruce Lee. Oh, why not? It's Chaska signs of the canopy. Looks like you saw. See you again, why not? Don't have time for pleasantries, get right to it. Here for the spirit speaker stone. Came from Sitlawi. On a second, tell me why you need it first. To go rescue Kachina from the Night Kingdom. Trap within the Night Kingdom. Start to find her ancient name and rescue her. Spirit Stone. Well then... Okay? Rescue her from the Night Kingdom. If you went in the front door with weapons, they would throw you out. They would swarm you. That's right. Grunt, someone needs to tell you what you don't want to hear. Going to a mature warrior would never make such a foolish decision. Sure battle off predictable, never know how it's going to end. Losing a friend is tragic, but that happens. Best thing you can do is learn how to prevent further casualties. Okay, cool. Do what you want. When every server except the Chinese server gets totally to- Actually, they just take down the European server, so I don't care. Trying to say, why not? Price of maturity, banning for a need, choose fullness any day, because she is still soaring on, and so will I. I might say that. Something wrong, why does it seem like you? She looks like an ear. If you went in and killed Da Wei, as a European, I don't think they would- they might get rid of the European server. Maybe. Not completely without taking wigs. Always been your mantra. It's nothing, Night Kingdom is a dangerous place. Can't blame for checking if you were up to the task. Determined, far be it for me to stop. Keep it safe, keep it safe. Not like we have a spare. Oh, that's funky looking. Seems like it has two separate portions moving back and forth. So what is your aim here? To actually just get rid of the game then? It's like you two go way back, aren't you from the Far Feather Clan? Chess is a peacekeeper, famous about the tribes. People call it result conflict, so we got to know each other that way. She doesn't really have an animo color scheme to be her at the same show of Kaza. But I guess maybe you could argue that might be why. There are a lot of weeks that say that her gimmick is going to be elemental absorption as a main DPS. Well then... Yeah, you, you probably should. I don't know. Go hunt wild boars or something. And your sister treats you, saying you're on the tribe, helped us out a lot in the past. Younger sister introduced you to her sometime. Back to business, so she starts to haggle you. Why well, not? How do we use the stone? Probably no. Intent and destination completely different from the real world. Kingdom is a river flowing with concepts. Ancient name is a tiny fish swimming downstream. Chase it, fishing boat, drifting down river, boat is enough. Fisherman experienced enough to stir it, steer it in the right direction, presumably to propel it too. We can do that ourselves. For practice, sure you could, have the strength, talent, make sure this works so it can prevent someone to you. Well, 
I would do it. And who is that? Vichama, a warrior scout from the tribe. He and I are well on intuition, and she needs to seek. Fishing for an end, gonna want him on the boat. That name sound familiar, and why? Or is that Kinich? No, Kinich is Yupon Ki. Or is that the guy who went down there before? Hot oh, no, Hot Spring Buddy. The story's about him. Can we find him? Since Malko passed, Mr. Chung gets an empty scenery from Cooktop, so that that way, sure you'll find him. We'll look for him there. Good luck, hope everything goes well. <laughs> look for Vichama. So he's just down there. Well, then I would carry them on me. Probably keep them in a belt instead of wearing them. Because having them restrained to my body, having them connected to my body would probably limit its capabilities a little too. Easiest way would just be throw it at someone and then bind them up or something instead of having it on me and just tying me to them. Also, that sounds incredibly contrived. Finding scenery from Quiptops, that must be him. That green hair. Those headphones? Those are goggles. Yichama? Yes, but that's different from clothes you actively hate. Color's something entirely different. Incredibly contrived. You can consult a dictionary if you need. It's me. Did he need something? Could she get the spirit speaker stone? Okay. Say, so you can bring something back from the night. How is that even possible? What do you think about it? Anything's possible in that kind of place, but that would mean. Okay, don't look so good. Mm -hmm. Legendary scout. It's fine, help you, but I do have a small request. Find Kachina's ancient name, but he's assumed to look for my friends as well. That might be dangerous. So, Malko, who you're talking about? If you're that angry about it, come help me take care of the dog. If they not get into it, it's all the same to you. No problem, we agree to your request. Helping us find Kachina's ancient name, I'll rightly return the favor. You're not beating the allegations. You can have a look at the stone. So is he going to be the one who brings us in, or... Where's our entry point? Probably a wild. Functions almost like an official pilot. Oh, because it is sort of gateway shaped. Alright. Well, there were a lot of people complaining about Chaska's design, actually. So, Palin, both connect the Night Kingdom to the living world. Actually, it's established this construction through the open like a predator of the middle of the Sure, not to use it in a tribal settlement. Got all that just from looking at it. Jump on the basics, really, no idea why it works. Sitwell the invented must be ingenious. Well, part of it is just the single sleeved pants. I mean, the single legged pants. Shorts on one side, pants on the other. When area starts setting things up, meantime, you need to get two things from me. Right away, what do you need? Need some hook ropes. Every store around here carries them. You need to go over special. You need to build a net out of them and get a good amount. Seeing you're going to use a real net to catch Kachin's ancient name. Not work when one's tangible and one's not. Something tangible in the world create a connection corresponding to concept in the kingdom. Concept of that catch them equal intangible ancient name. Second thing you need is. One, two chunks of obsidian. Should names in, need a place to store them. Oh, so presumably the obsidian stone is kind of gone. From the children of Echoes, Trump and Merchant will travel around here, try and walk in there. Gotcha. Split up, square, meet over there when you're done. Send someone with me if you want, in case you're worried about taking the stone for myself. I think Chaska. Who needs Bokadi? Needs her trustworthy. Doesn't mean much to me anymore. Oh, what is friend I? Hang up, no need to rush, I'll see you in a bit. Hmm. An odd guy seems so defeated, really invested in the stone at the same time. Hmm. 
don't have any more insight than you. Let's just focus on the preparations for now. Sheena, we're coming for you. Hmm. There! A lot, a lot of the time... It seems to me like the motivations... Are less sometimes from liking. It is nice. Liking how the new ones, the edits look, and more... This con a concept of sort of retaliation, I would say. It... I think among other things, what it might say, for better or worse, is just that... Trying to make a game like this that appeals to a mixed gender audience is inherently untenable. And that there are a lot of. That's fair. I wonder if we can talk to one of those Yunkasaurs now that we're in a Yunkasaur form. Do you have. Hmm. Not right now. Okay. Preparation to seek the ancient name. There, there were people I saw talk records of Hanan Pacha. Oh, and it's not a tapestry. Talking about dropping the game. No, no, I'm pretty sure that you can, but you need to find the right the right ones, ones with actual name tags. Dropping the game because a plus eighteen Yaoi game just came out. Well, it... Apparently it's basically like this game's gameplay, but it's... Adult content, and it's all yaoi, apparently. It's what a cursory Google search just told me. And it... I mean, there... Love in Deep Space is kind of like this, but... You know... Women targeted hetero stuff. As, as time goes to infinity... In theory, you know, in a hundred years, there are going to be seven billion games on the planet, and everyone will just play their own tailored game for them. The Nintendo Switch. I have heard about that, especially since a lot of people, and this was years ago, people notating that, noting that Sony was at, Sony was actually very, very strict about censorship in comparison, and that it kind of surprised them. Uda. Especially since for a while back during the PS3 era especially. PS3, PS4 era. So a lot of Sony's marketing and a lot of things they said publicly was basically Nintendo is for kids. And when Nintendo kids grow up, they start playing Sony games. So th And they were very, very smug about it. And it was funny to see that kind of get discarded in a weird kind of way though to be fair that's not necessarily untrue in the sense that their interpretation of adult was one that excluded sort of quote-unquote themes in that sense and it was all about getting rid of boutique studios in favor of making big games made basically exclusively to get awards at the game awards honestly not even actually make money and that's how you get stuff like the last of us being a Five game game series that only actually has two games because they made, remade one of their games one time and remade, remade the other game two times. Any hook ropes for sale? Hook ropes, rock climbing equipment. How much for your whole stock? Whole thing? 30,000 more in total? Deal. So, on a guy, we really can drive down the price and use as fast as possible things. No problem at all. Swelling information on the house. Use by rock on the enthusiast. Want to learn rock as the person who has. Well, it. It's the consequence of Americanization. The, the most. 
notable. aspects of it is that they're sort of star director is a guy named Neil Druckmann who is basically like evil Hideo Kojima in that everything he does is oh you mean that well Neil Druckmann's whole deal is that he wishes he could be making movies and is angry that he has to make video games instead Whereas Kojima is just a guy who really likes movies and maybe wishes he could also make movies, but also just really likes making games. Because there are a lot of people online, this was Twitter discourse some time ago, basically trying to compare Druckmann and Kojima. Basically saying, sure, you know, maybe it'd be great if Kojima could make a movie. And he wants to, he said he wants to, but he's he enjoys making games. If he didn't like making games, he would stop making games. And that Kojima's experimentalism and attempts to sort of use the trappings of the game medium to create interesting experiences, interesting pieces of work, is not the kind of thing someone who just wishes they were making movies instead would do. Information, Rock Climb Enthusiast, Rook is the person you want to ask. That's everything here we go. The Obsidian Tuck, the Traveling Merchant, and Beach Shaman mentioned. That's fast. Purpose built grappling hooks, special grappling hooks, on can be especially safe, exceptionally safe. Rough rock climbing is this with rapid descents. Can we get you? Yeah, yeah. I gotta play Metal Gear sometime. Logitech. They're starting to sell ports and collections on Steam now. Do you still I actually bought Metal Gear 5 when it was on sale a couple years ago. But I want to play them in order. Honestly, probably starting with the very first ones on. I think it was. MSX, some kind of Japanese PC. Yeah, so Obsidian got a chunk of percent right over there. Only one, actually need two. Might be tough. Look through the box to see what we can find. We'll wait here. This cool eyepiece. Like a jeweler. Things going according to plan. It's just could tell Peach on the fuels in the way, same way that his friend that knew about Kachina. Sidon isn't the only one. It's just shiny stones. I thought it was on trap. Full pot of sitting ready in a heartbeat. Do look at that. Bring an extra. Does it work? Well, I might have said this already, but they added a sort of temporary transformation into a wink so you can just attack directly with a sword instead. Which, interesting as an idea. I'm not sure how much I'd actually like to use it when I play it. Should I owe you? I hadn't shown up since so Sather collecting dust. He does more for Mo. Be shama just now. Aaron for now. It's been Mo has been gone for five years. Time to start to move forward. Oh, so it's probably dissipated. What happened between them? There is a sword fighter form transformation that lets you basically turn into Link. Drink one night, don't know all the details. We Chan and Malco grew up together, made a name for themselves together. Some fire kept knocking out multiple opponents in a single hit. Chan excelled at scouting, analyzing the battlefield. Two main excellent team, mentioned beat back the abyss several times. Just go, both of them are triumphant in pilgrimage, replacing the same team to fight the abyss. If a battle, abyss launched attack on their tribe. She must suffer an injury to his leg, attempting to rescue someone. Basically, yeah. Then what happens? They agree that he couldn't go fight the abyss in his condition. Bichama didn't argue. You go in the front lines with injured leg, make him a burden battle, raise the issue with power arc, and you want to stay behind. Malcolm the others face forward his abyssal monsters. Far to stay his expectations, made an error in judgment, and fell to the onslaught. To deep pressure after that, blamed himself for everything. It was a situation that wasn't his fault. Not wrong, plus he chooses to blame himself. I'm sure people have joked about the boyfriend hoodie. Let me just see. Hmm. Okay, so someone drew Zelda dressed as Link and said it was the boyfriend fit. But let me see. Okay, yes, yes. And they're not referencing the sword fighter form directly, but there were a couple people drawing Zelda in Link's outfit and saying boyfriend fit. 
himself, not because he did something wrong, because he wasn't able to do anything at all, trying to conceal the forts, dwelling in the past, the shadow of Marco is a jab hangs over him still. This caused so much suffering, some wounds never heal, which there was something to do to make himself feel better. I, I, I feel like... There's only one way that that can really end. Feel better anyway, that's the gist of it. Maybe good help in toxins for some time, would really appreciate it. Hmm. Ordinary obsidian, simple unadored piece of obsidian, become a vessel for an ancient name. And we have two of them, that's fine. Actually noted that. We can move past this whole thing soon. Meet up with him on the Uta. Anything else I can get you? The answer is no. Hokano Hoshimono. Yeah, I think... Maybe one of your lesbians will convince you to do that one day. And just tell you to do it again and again before you know. Maybe. So we need to go up there on top, kinda? Mm -mm. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Just keep grappling, which is nice. That! Very convenient, fast movement. Wow. I wonder if that was quest specific, but these pylons seem interesting. Okay. Did you get everything? Yep, it's all here. Where do we start? Mystery agent, so we're good to go. It's great to help you find Kachin's ancient name, then you return the favor to ask a question. And it's ancient name for the same reason as us. Which one? Marco fell, the Yunka sword. Scroll the battlefield to see what happened. It wasn't bested by an impossibly powerful foe, dragged it as raid by the sheer number of enemies. I'd been there and never since the danger could warn them not to advance. Blame myself for what happened when he told me on Kachina. There's a chance Marco might be alive, like survival in the Night Kingdom. That's the Yunka sword. Several years ago, right? So you think he's still there? Power God said, all life within the Night Kingdom eventually becomes one with a sea of souls. And not mere hope, self to try, Marco and I promise each other if we never manage to root out the abyss for good, fight together until the end. To get to it, search through to me conceptualized version of Kachina's ancient name, see any fragments scattered around the earth, please collect them. Ah, so we got a minigame here. That's fun. I know you won't. Feel bad about it. Should we prepare ourselves for battle? Some will link the border we're out in the Night Kingdom, abyss will be rooted in response. Oh, we got a special icon, one of the fragments, let's get closer. Pick them up like this. An existing world for one, pick them up as soon as possible. Okay. And now they're getting shot out again. It's just sort of a run around kind of thing. And actually, my question is Is this Fogiston or. I don't know. I feel like those might be Fogiston lamps. Monsters incoming, watch out everyone. Okay, so that's not. Fugison we can use right there, so let's put this down and okay. Hit there, defeat the attacking monsters, so that should help Emily work a little better, maybe. Right. This is okay-ish. Right. And good stuff. Got a couple more. Keep the burning her up for a big vaporize. Come on, come on, come on, and fight! And there we are. Cool. Oh, there are more of them? You've gotta be kidding. Ooh, huh. Come on. You know, confidence is good. And let's go down here. Bite. We'll take down this one. I did not mean to hit you here. I. I can't even can't even deny that honestly. And uh, maybe the faster we do that, the better. Maybe. All right. Look for another hit. A fun comparison. Continue collecting fragments. That might be the end of the fight. How uh, long? Well, we're getting close. If we guess it, that was my question. Good and fast. Okay, Netzel transmission. Well, it, there's only so many kinds of purple you can make. Oh, and interactables. Get that too. That's fun. Okay. So if we not miss the very first one to try to see how the dialogue went, it would have taken just that wave. So the one sort of singleton there. 
Is he gonna get eaten or possessed or? Because it's scary. It's a frightening power. Quick, take it. Oh, so is he gonna get consumed or? Wait. She's ancient men hanging their mall go just a little longer. It's not gonna be here, is it? Not right, but the abyss is getting stronger. Uh oh. It's cool music, Cronus, but I can't go and you'll die. So, can we provide support by purifying? So, died five years ago. Oh. Ooh. Just need a little more time, please. I'm almost there. I'm gonna support him, help buy some time by. Yep, purification. Thank you, and. Oh, it's a QTE! Okay, cool. Ooh. Are we gonna have to fail this or something? That would be crazy if it's one you just can't win. This is strong. This feels like a Kirby end boss. They always got a button mash QT at the end of Kirby Bosses. Arg. It would be crazy if we just couldn't succeed this time and it just huge backwash that forced me all the way back to the start. Let's see what happens. You can hear me mashing right now, too. Okay, it worked. Interesting. It's cool that they're finally bringing back, from Mondstadt even, just us being able to purify Abyss in the storyline. Hanging in there, can't hold him back much longer, running out of time. Can't I find him? He's already dissipated. Why? I would any longer pull him away from the stone. Are you tried? Power the Abyss as him in a chokehold, tied to the stone with an invisible rope. Oh, no choice, sorry, so why? Oh, she's gonna blow up the stone. Yokero. Cool bow. Shaska and... That's a cool CT. I mean, cool CG. How empathetic. What happened just now? Spirit Speaker Stone was... Blowing up. So it's power spawning out of control and we stop it was destroying. Oh, caught in the shockwave, the explosion might hold dizzy for a while, but that's normal. That's impossible. So next time, I can manage to dodge in time. Set it back. Didn't time the iframes, right? Second before he made a go poop, not everyone has a reflex as Chaska. This course again dragged into the explosion. And is he blown up now, or more careful next time? He changed ancient name, still in one piece. Where's Vichama? Very dead. Oh, well. Or not. Every scout. He's gone. Couldn't find Mako's ancient name. Must be completely gone by now. Ancient name disappears. No coming back. In the very beginning, I knew there was some chance, but still. Now it's too late to save him from the mini weapon that It was already too late. Hmm. Should we turn enough condolences over the years? Just give him some space. Hmm. Is that in your hands? Something is glowing. And still the obsidian? This is? Did it work, or...? What are we gonna learn? Some sort of final piece of information about his death, or...? Ah, oh, final flashback. Peace up. And strength left. Not to swing his sword, say a few last words. <laughs> Too bad no one will get to hear them. Got a relic, basically. Never thought actually down the mission. Now that I'm afraid to die, just start thinking about the mom's face when she hears the news. Something to be thankful for. Parents dead a long time ago won't have to mourn me. Hmm. I was there to beat me at everything, right to the end, you never wore one for goodbyes. Well, you're right, no one got to hear our last words, just in case. So glad you didn't come with us. It's sad, keep on living for the both of us. It's three Rift Towns! Come on. Weak. So, at least you gotta see that. Hmm. Is that a memory? It's from the past. We're able to salvage something after all, feeling any better. Of course, seeing him hearing his voice again makes me unbelievably happy. You're all out. So it brings with it an even deeper pain. Kurushimi? Nandeda? Always the time to put on a brave face. Memory just now, hands were shaking, spine was forced. All these years, you're getting not being a pathetic one side until the end. Now I know end of his life, thinking the same thing. Mm. 
I'd actually heard wine. It wasn't really on board with the planet Go to the Night Kingdom. It's for my help, it's sedated too, new, helping you find your friends' action in, one step closer to danger. So understand why you had to try, everyone has regrets in life, but everyone gets the chance to make up for them. So what a fester guilt strips us of our most valuable qualities as warriors. As we'll choose the braver path from the beginning, courageous way, fighting while injured. We can do it all over again, but if fought and to the front lines, no matter what, even with an injured leg, we're still things I can have done. Mm -hmm. Even if the outcome stayed the same, still would have fought alongside him to the end. Critical junctures in life, and if you don't seize the chance to act, there's no going back. It's something I had to learn in hindsight, but you're still the crossroads of your journey. Hope you can walk away without your rants. Thank you, Vichrama. If you're even more determined now, Katuna will come back to us. I'll make sure of it. So we get to see a bit more of what the abyss is like. In the spiral bits, there's that one little bit in the chasm class. I don't to see my close, but I must have to find her, and I intend to keep that promise. It's good to hear. Strange, my body is feeling light, or maybe because of the healing power of Jesus. Corrosion enters the body, portion will fuse itself to internal organs. Pairs of purification, corrosion never be fully eradicated. Oh, so actually we can't do that much. Simbo, when we briefly expose, so breathing, controlling motions help to keep the symptoms in check. Oops, permanent injury. Magic cancer. Hmm. Does it make me feel better? Seem very knowledgeable about all this and why. Speaking from experience, that's all. Recovered Kachina's ancient name after a great storm, yet Vicham went back to his tribe and shall wine the good news. Well, should I say leprosy instead? Oh, so as for destroying the spirits who were so had no choice, you'll probably understand, right? <laughs> Face palm. Okay. And we can teleport it back. It seems like something just spawned in the area where we were. Chui Chu. Chi. Are we gonna just say Quiku? Oh, Quiku. Something like that. Don't know what you want from me. Not exactly what I'm trying to say. Hear it in your voice. Oh, that's Chaska's sister, right? Thing after another with you too. They're back. Playable character sibling, NPC sibling. What are you doing here? Can't point down with her own sister. Know exactly why I'm here. Yeah, very unique body, but unmistakably NPC face. Maybe. At least she has no vision. Maybe she's too symmetrical to be a playable character. Apologies, everyone. Need to borrow Cheska for a few minutes. Come with me. Yeah, fair. But it... They, they only did Ayato and Ayaka both being playable once. Just a moment. If she had not shown up for a while, that would be another thing. So they could actually work on design. Who was that? The sister, the younger sister. Two aren't actually related by blood. Oh, interesting. Story, sister, more to the story. Well, my story to tell, it's not a secret. She was actually raised by Kukasaurus. Corin Geovision moment. Chaska is kind of the sort of Corin slash Dia archetype. Well, apparent maybe Navia more, because apparently... People are saying that Chaska is going to come out in 5.2. Flicked with a rare disease when she was a child, abandoned the wild as a result. This found her out there all on her own, trying to devour her. In the end, all the demonstrator her will live. So is she corroded too, or? Maybe a vision might help, but that didn't help a tank. She had a power vision and still died of this stuff. Her disease. Hmm. Strength will push her spot, but it's sealed with conflict. Adopted by the Kukasaurs, where they went, she followed, getting into fights with Pike and Rat. Kukuryo. For some reason, Bob can imagine that. <laughs> Chaska finally returned to human society. Chuji's parents who adopted her, same time. That's what happened getting into fights. Chuchu, Kuku, was taking her around, apologizing to everyone. <laughs> One of those days, one of the fights definitely with me. Fighting one minute and friends the next. Oh, so they actually around the same age, or in a way to rein in the desire to fight. Now she's who people call the resolve conflicts known as the peacemaker. 
Like she still argues with Kukuno, it's so easier to stop fighting when they get older. Wow, I have some experience with that. It's probably my fault, Kukuno asked me to stop chess from doing anything dangerous, but I know by now. Chess didn't make up her mind, just they're changing it. I don't know why you tried to talk yourself going to the Night Kingdom, Chess even said that wasn't like you. Mm -hmm. After adventure, you need to take a risk when you were young. Time your might, you couldn't attempt something like that even if you wanted to. Try to live regrets later, that's what I say. I'm not sure I said this specifically, but the reason they're all gone is because they're taking her off to college. Still, I understand where Kuku is coming from. In the end, nobody wants to sit back and all the and put their life on the line. So then, touching the bed? Just the two of us now. One minute to explain yourself. She thinks she'll catch goblin disease or something. Don't have anything to say. Don't have to approve. She know I only do what's necessary. Yarubeki koto. Mm -hmm. Alright, down to two, this is exactly the problem, like you don't care, sneak off to the kingdom on the back, put it down like it's a trip abroad. Technically, I'm going abroad. With excuses. Agreed, didn't we? Four levels of danger, not something urgent, can only engage in a level two danger and below. And we have to level three if it's so dire, no alternative. And four, never, presumably? Night Kingdom, not a level four, don't know what it is. But... What about level five? Fantasy life. It's going to sneak into the place without saying anything. Sneak into the place, walking in there with my head held high. What if Uncle Wan? Oh, presumably the reason why she's got a red color scheme is probably in part because. Even though she's Animo, she has Pyrosaurian powers, presumably. Stop you from doing anything dangerous like he didn't even try. Back on his word, told him I was made up, nothing he could have done, not even by force. He tried to say something, but you didn't listen. It's important if you were in my shoes, you'd make the same decision. To know that, I'm a doctor and I had logistics. Once into a dangerous situation, he was controlled any moment, it's my duty to say something. My older sister's in danger. Got that? Anything else? Oh. Does she have OCD? Mean anything else? Don't reflect on what you've done. Promise me you'll stay put. Well, my arguments are more serious one. Sound like I'm joking. I need to know something. What happened to Kachina was partially my fault. Can leave her there to die and not who I am. Responsibility. So be calm you lose control, not who you are. Mm. Fair enough. Different issue, set it your- oh, okay. First, there's only as good as their morals. They're not on display. Qualities that make me worthy of this nation. What is interesting is that it reminds me a bit of... Indian culture has a lot of fixations on the idea of contamination. Which means, in part, people generally are not willing to wear clothes that have been worn by other people. It's part of it. Control of you, managing conditions is equally important. You have to make sacrifices, the stop is here, keep going, you might actually have to get serious. One prefers his roof attached to his house. That sounds like a threat to me. Kuku, one your sister's supposed to listen to their elders. Because you're constantly slaughtered in mud or something. Really going to go, no matter what I say, it's supposed to be your sister. Support me, I'll be back, all I have to do is wait. Hmm. Cheska. So annoying. Okay. Something else? Something you wanted to say, or... No, you're not related by the line? Sure, it's similar. Sokai? Everything to Kuku not too long ago. We have the same way, down to their two little boys. Oh. I can relate. But it's mostly because I'm very sensitive to body odor. 
Not like supposed to get involved, we'll say this. We'll talk to your sister, tough kids. Doesn't mean you have to go out alone. Thank you. Arigato. Each time we'll write down this brief speaker stone. Might as well hand it over. Freeze. Oh, okay. Oh, if they get cold. I can't imagine it would ever get cold in South Italy. Porn ceremony. I'll reflect to Kinich, according to Kinich. Safe to keep it with me. About that? When we turned up, Vanti was here, repaired it like the liar. Yeah, more Mondstadt mentions. A few more pieces than you remember. Because we had to blow it up. Just in a sequence of events. Yeah. Presumably it could be repaired. Urgent situation, so his life is on the line. Had no choice. Situation is going to be an unmade deal with none that you've broken or so explain everything to her later. Well, maybe if it smells bad. There in that kingdom, wait here for your safe return. And of that one. With a beauty, okay. Echoes of life. Bring it to Mavuika. Go all the way over there then. Just check out. It just says with Abiti, and it's four star. Kachina's ancient name, point unadorned obsidian. Seems to be a bit heavier than expected. Said you can use it to find Kachina's approximate location. Oh, it's it's relative things. Okay. That makes sense. Anyone got anything to say? Oh, he does. It's you again. Have a safe journey, overcome any danger that comes your way. Interesting. Yeah, sometimes when I go on a bath and body works or something, the smell is overwhelming to me. So we can reach down that really good range. I feel like that's longer than a four week sigil's range, too. And I have to do that jump, but that's fine. It's a shame that they're so slow, though. That's the thing. Oh, interesting. So, oh, and we can aim that. Can we blow this up? Yeah, we can just blow them up. That's fun. You know what else is like bombs? It actually vaporized, but it didn't seem to increase the damage by any meaningful amount. Well, no, because he doesn't throw bombs himself. It doesn't throw bombs itself, it can just absorb bombs in the environment. Because Kinich can do that too. So you get Kinich, that's also going to be an option for us. Either way, I should probably... Bombs. Bombs are like bombs. Okay, put that down. This down, okay, cool. Oh, so did someone get knocked off, or... I think one of them just got knocked off. Okay. Well, we can keep this going. That's fine. So he's back, okay. Come on. Please, please. Wow, how nice of you. The answer was not very. It was actually a pretty good joke. Thank you. Let Emily handle this. Akinich is going to actually be pretty decent for and with Emily, but I suppose we'll pick those up too. Keep sitting, hitting the lantern. Okay. We'll go back, rest a little bit. Thank you. You know, I'm glad you actually approved this time. Thought you would just get angrier, and then I'd have to say something about hypocrisy, maybe. Maybe. Between that, another thing of corn. These red flowers are actually rather annoying to find. Yeah. She... Burning is not a great reaction. To say the least. And she needs it to work. And her damage is good. But for her to really be useful... She needs characters who, and part of it is also that her scent collection requires maintaining burning, and she can't actually maintain constant burning by herself. Her denture application isn't good enough. She can maintain constant pyro. It's not the same as constant burning. 
So for her damage potential to be good, she actually needs another Dendro on the team to keep the burning application off. Yeah, thank you. Saying that the dog is manipulating me is pretty funny, but I don't necessarily disagree. It... The, the dog really just rules my life. In every meaningful way. Well, not every single way, but a lot of them. Alright. Get over there. Get over to that waypoint. Get my Fulgiston back. Talk to Silly Mavlika. Okay. What if Miku was Mavliku and she was the Pyro Archon? Okay. It's not American Woof Woof. He's not anything other than a dog. He's just a dog. Okay. And he's not evil, he just... ...doesn't really have a brain. Okay, so we'll go to that speaker's chamber. I guess we could teleport there. Yeah, teleport point out there, but it's fun to do it this way whenever I can. Well, I- you said he was manipulating me, and I didn't entirely agree. You know, who's the one being mean now? Oh, come on. Well, no, Brian? He's not from Family Guy. Okay, now we can get up and continue around. Yep, here we are. That would've worked either way. Let's get that back, go in here, and go to the Night Kingdom. Okay. Is this the final part of the quest line, or...? Hmm. It's Yansan again, found Kachina's ancient name too, what happened at the stadium. Here we come, kid, give it a condensed version. Condensed version. Resin, Power of battle against the captain, as well as her sacrifice. Matafadoika? Thank you. Can't go anywhere without them causing trouble. So he finds out you've lost your power when they try to take advantage of the situation. That's a little secret no one else can know, or we're asking for trouble. Someone's gonna find out, though. Hmm. Wish I could offer you some sort of consolation, but why do multiple factions closing in? Nothing comforting about the situation we're facing. All you need to do is focus on your goal, and you'll be complicated matters to me. On the power of behalf, I'm to what I can accomplish, help you however I can. She'd better be a five star. <laughs> you need to be modest, Yonsan. Incredible strength has long been a well known fact. The pride of your tribe. Mm -hmm. Sorry about before, I have so much on your plate, so much that I have to worry about. I do is focus on my own feelings. She'd buy both balls. Baby Bennett. For by your emotions, myself included, Rakshi Kijina's disappearance, I understand that feeling very well. Now we have her ancient name, let's go track her down, follow me. Mm. That feeling of disappearance. I know that there's some information about her human family somewhere in this patch, but I'm not sure if it's a this quest or a different one. Boy, I'm still burning. Oh! We're in Mavuika's own room. So it's probably in here then. Oh, she sacrificed it to keep the fire burning. Because the ley lines are broken and it couldn't keep burning normally. What is this place? Atea's talisman. Ooh. Middle of that Omamori. Could I? Where I store all the various mementos I've collected. I've seen this place before. So many things in here. I'm from every tribe, but it must have taken a lot of effort. <laughs> it is interesting that there aren't any actual story in local legends. There are two Fatui characters, two that are just animals, just plain old animals, and then actually one of them might drop story and stuff. I'm not sure. Maybe. Probably not. And then there are three Wyobs and three Saurian warriors, and each of those is, I think, one in the overworld. 
I'm sure every tribe probably that must have taken a lot of effort. Think of that as a hobby of sorts, no one ever was up listening to stories of heroes. Fangirl, physical items do a far better job presuming the stories that are of memory. Since preparation to make for the ceremony, feel free to take a look around in the meantime. First about an item, more than willing to tell you about its origins. Sonore Kishi, about history. Okay, have a look. Now examine the mementos within the room. Check out the class and so that's each of the two acts has had three separate quests in it. Room full of mementos while you wait for the ceremony preparations to be completed. So actually I did not see check that description before. Serve the talisman, Vivica. Oh, debate club right there. Still some preparation to make for the ceremony. Feel free to take a look around in the meantime. Tell you about its origins. Oh, and that's the picture of her family. So, right, she was actually one of the signs of the canopy before that. Makes it more interesting that she had red hair from the start. Sort of the jar. Jar product. Jars and potions around here. Anything to do with alchemy. Growing masters of the night wind, ceremonial tools, amplify the ability to communicate with the night kingdom in the wild. It's a bit like spirit and boring old baby. Yemaya, expert in the field, taught me a lot, even though she appears stoic and serious, actually has a keen sense of humor. Had a playable character. Mm -hmm. Tools you see here are quite traditional, students find them outdated, so you pass them on to me. Modern incense comes into the jar and all that special, except the big jar in the middle. She really wanted to give me. Mm. Must be something really cool. What's inside? Grape juice. Eventually turning into wine or white taste seal. They're probably expired by now. Hmm. Talk to Mavuika. Look at one. Is she going to repeat this whole song and dance? Tools of Ayamaya. Someone out of point star. Grape juice. Would have given the trap. She wasn't scared. It was expired. It's probably wine by now. And we actually cannot weave at the moment. Interesting. So, would it just restart the quest, presumably, if we got out of here and sort of sand garden in the middle? Though it looks like it's fine, good at taking care of plants. And Milani, fishing equipment. Fishing basket looks familiar. Maybe a tail related too? I suppose. Fishing equipment. Fishing rod here must belong to the people of the springs. That's right, belongs to legendary fisherman Matavaru. Set of fishing equipment, actually. At a tavern, a particular kind of giant fish, and was plan to catch it. Hunger and a strong fighting spirit in the sea was the battlefield upon which he staked his honor. Fanny still like boss fish moment. Did he do it? No. Some Asan covered in scars, fish he saw had been corroded by the abyss. To kill the fish, same serious injury in the process, he can never go deep sea fishing again. Fisherman Quinn Victory fails to bring back his catch, but he asked me in the end. Thinks you won. Answer as well, experience was more valuable than the prize itself. Didn't want his tools to go to waste, so he gave them to me. Means also know how to fish. Or. Maybe we can go head to head sometime. Fishing contest. Pretty sure not one actually doesn't have any fishing spots right now. Maybe. I tell you, talisman. Familiar with this one already? Rarely ever without it. It's been brought her a lot of luck in battle. Hmm. Tess talisman brought her a lot of luck. Well, maybe. Fishing rod left by a legendary fisherman of Matavar. See, if the sea were a battlefield, this would have been his sword. Gotta give us a character who fights with a fishing rod like Pessy from JoJo Part 5. But you can see they literally have record players in here. They're actually rather high tech, despite the aesthetic. Sort of the belt and that. Fucked of a pronty? Belt is bigger than Paimon's head. That collective of plenty known for their bodybuilding competitions, contests of strength, great honor within the tribe. So she had strength, might have also been the reason the original belt was extremely heavy, difficult for even two people to lift. 
worry how this should make you put on when you're threatening like Matan when you've been gasping for breath. Sounds like it. And Yansan is from the Collective 22. Owner of the original bow, Mrs. Craft will make a copy identical appearance with far wider and weight the belt you see before you. Often wear this version of training to protect his waist. We made a wider version so he could wear it all the time and show it off. Mm -hmm. The belt. The belt belonged to Kito at the war, caught the original, even Panmon could watch it by herself. Even Panmon. Handle everything with care. This cup, for example, it's heavier than it looks. Some kapu. Just said it's very heavy, basically. Talisman, fishing equipment. The belt. The jar. Night wind, collected with plenty. These are people the springs. The weapon. Yeah, the debate coil there. Oh? Weapon is huge, which rabbit it belong to? Not at all. Weapon walked a ten oak here from 500 years ago. Oh, 500 years ago. So why is the cataclysm? Scrubbing the debate club, which people think means the Mari Javari isn't 500 years either. It didn't belong to any single tribe. For the Zesworthy of this broke out, already been exiled. Suiho Sareta. Exiled. Suiho. Punishment out of necessity, except for all the same believe it was what he deserved. When the Abyss attacked, trust saw themselves in urgent need of a power player to lead them into the battle. They were more courageous and resolute than him. Mm -hmm. You know, the six tribes and accomplished great feats throughout the war. He died 500 years ago. He perished because he had already lost his ancient name. The Oak Resurrection was able to bring him back. Yep. So, we had to rest alongside the countless wars and civilians who lost their lives buried in the soil of his native land. We don't even have Kachina's body unless it was. Stored somewhere, sounds like a true hero. Indeed, even now, his story is told throughout the land. You don't have to try too hard for that. Don't stress yourself out. Weapon used by the hero Tenok from 500 years ago size is truly impressive. Hmm. I wonder if debate quote would be any good on Mubuika. Eh, probably not. It really, really sucks. Powder still needs time to settle, wait a little longer. Actually, it's probably your exploration passive. Don't imagine it'll be all that useful in combat. Do you think of my collection? Do you feel like you have a better understanding of that one's culture now? Not one's bunka, not one's culture, yeah. John represents a different story, that one's really been through a lot. Mm. Every item holds a special memory like a taste talisman. Actually, maybe! Maybe you're a taunter. Your goal is to draw aggro so everyone else can fight. Probably. That's right, items my collection actually serve a similar purpose. The ancient name passed down along with the tribes. And you say the true shape of time. And what is that? Cyclical? As people perceive time later, a concept like a straight line that can only move forward cannot change the past or predict the future. Give me some Luma fate stuff. So a different theory, one that would be closer to the truth. Past, present, and future all exist at once. Oh goodness, not the cyclical to that kind of thing. I once, not sure she understands. So your journey ended right now. Looking back and experience the intonation, which one that's the most important, have to say all of them. And of your journey, things you experience along the way don't cease to exist become part of who you all are. Portion of that journey, like make very different decisions and arrive at a very different destination. Future is the same way, exists even though it is yet to come to pass, just like needs to perceive it. So that's very deterministic. First, there are those with the power to perceive the future, called by a different name, fate, but from a concept, I would imagine. It kind of makes sense, future hasn't happened, but it already exists. Well, it sounds a living the present too often to forget the past and neglect the future. Ancient names record the past. And presumably constellations are the future. 
pilgrimage to Nagorno War is the lead us to the future. Oh, okay. Sounds more figurative than realistic. See that not only the banners themselves, but the tops of them are different. I think in part they reflect maybe the Saurians in part. Uniting them across countless areas can we fight back against an enemy as formidable as the Abyss. Well, such a set of rules for Spyro Argon must be a level inside, I can only imagine. Grab the rules of not one. Correct? At first, was a mortal man, no special power. Send it to the Divine Throne, use it power power from the heavens or Ronova. Except for the rules of not one. Is that Nahuatl? Who knows? I don't. Namely, framework through which ordinary people can ascend to Archonhood. So that's only possible if not one. Will the Pokemon be able to determine the strongest am among us? At first, the sense of the Divine Throne, their inner flame will awaken. Hmm. Addition, sacred flame, grant the sacred knowledge and memory of the land. How I came to know everything I just told you. Who? No, because there are humans just around here. So under the power of the Divine Throne and the rules. That a family portrait? Yep, exactly. This is where we see it. Signs of the canopy. A little sister. Father, mother, younger sister, and the sword is raised. It's my dad's leather armor into a canvas. Mr. Famous artist of paint or likeness. It... Well, well, he was born here. I, I saw someone once, and I don't know if they were taking the piss or not, but they described just a standard fantasy manga or something as native isekai, and people were just tearing their hair out in frustration. So Q, looks like you two are really close. Hard time thinking of an archon as an ordinary person seeing this portrait kind of makes sense now. Mm -hmm. Native Isekai. Does not look like there's anything special about you before? I'm proud to say that. Oh, goodness. Well, she did have red hair. But only for that question, don't you think? So sorry, her mouth works faster than her brain. Always. Well... Because they're using isekai as just a stand-in for any kind of fantasy concept. <laughs> Already never never get upset over something like that. No matter what others may say, past is a precious part of my identity forever proud of the life I used to lead. Mm. I mean, the Archon doesn't use severed ties with her family, because it comes with a lot of responsibilities and backs off and you get to see them. Well, people are very stupid. Father made this delicious stew, sister would often bring me a large pot of his cooking, so I'd like and eat it together. Tell me didn't close the door securely, so was a raising brand of the room knocked over the entire pot. Extremely mm -hmm. burst into tears, to trouble my ears going for the meat, saw my sister's distress froze on the spot. So remember the way they weigh, they're still like a pair of children, even after making a mess, frustrating in the end, all I could do was comfort my sister and move on. Yeah. Eh? Forgave them like that. Speaking of family is all about. I think about that story a lot, actually. So does that make you the opposite? Archon made about advanced nation and experiences like that remind me exactly what I'm trying to protect. Well, what happened after that? Portrait looks pretty old. Since you all grown up by now, right? Killed by the abyss or something. Ended up working as an architect and artist, many houses, crafting many beautiful works of art. No, it's just a comedy. And you're the protagonist. About me, powder is set, we can begin. Over here. Ancient name up there, and then we'll begin. Up where? I'm gonna get a little bit of popcorn to eat in just a second. You're welcome. If you better than calling you an unfunny clown. Okay. 
Oh, oh, so we have to do it ourselves. So place it on where? Objective in this area. Up there. Anything for carbs. Protein too. Oh, that arrow's there. So they have to stay first. So need anything for calories. That's right. I've definitely been underfeeding myself for a while. It's not good. Yeah, we'll see how much weight I'm gaining once I start having those meal shakes. Is there 400 calories per? Yeah. I'd have to agree with you. Don't worry, it won't happen again. Okay, so they don't have anything to say yet. Just have to place this down. Okay. Hmm. And they presume we walked on to their bed. True is the echoes of life, resound through heaven and earth, so true shoulder stories remain eternal. Echoes of life is the name of this one class. I'm doing it! Ancient name takes to her fated bear and allow her to answer her call. Faded bearer. Oh, hello. Uh -huh. Am I hallucinating again? Not that Kinkaku. You okay? Not seeing things is the best playing tricks on me again. It's okay, just us trying to find a way to bring you back. To listen to me. Which is, don't come here? Best game night kingdom this entire time. Figure out what's wrong and why I was being affected by the abyss. Yeah. And for the wild to see me back, this really strong monster came and almost killed. Double killed her? Wild saved me, even though its power is weakening. Hiding from the monsters while trying to find a way to help. Night Kingdom has become a huge mess. Keep hearing these awful sounds, seeing really horrible things. Mm. Listen to those sounds, Abyss is trying to strip you of your sanity. When you do a safe safe life for us, we'll be there shortly. Touching Sugani Mukao. Okay, feeling so much better now that I have a chance to talk to you guys. Don't need to worry about me. Never been stronger, special at all, really. Don't blame anyone for forgetting about me or leaving me behind. So you care is more than enough. Mm. On the way back, don't have to put yourself in danger to come rescue me. Well, I was like this, and now it's not time to act tough. We're coming to you, and that's final. Mm -hmm. Don't know why is the abyss has been feeding, tell you something right now, no one sees her as a burden. The word they use for burden is basically the same as luggage, too, which is funny. Victor of the wars, you have not one, all you need to do is wait for us to rescue. All the applause and recognition you deserve. Aww. I was scared, it was so dark and creepy, and I want to go home. Well, we're gonna save her, presumably. When you put yourselves in danger because of me, don't want to hold anyone back ever again. What you do is place your trust in us like you always have. No one fights alone, not leaving behind, not ever. Hmm. So close, can't call it quits now. Thank you. Oh, starting to flicker out, so we gotta go now. Let's get there. Lost contact, now comes the most dangerous part. You have to traverse the night kingdom in a physical form. And 
Where's our right hand? Nukutai, basically meat body. Enters the night kingdom, is left behind after an abyssal invasion. In a brief amount of time inside, it exposes you to corrosion. Mm -hmm. No, I'm prepared for that possibility. My heart is ready, basically. All right, and I wish you all the best. Talk quick, here to be ready as a case. Her experience in dealing with abyssal corruption. Mm, yep, she asked his sister. Face just made, don't tell me you two got into another argument. I feel bad for creating more work for her. I'll go with them too. More time, more people, the stronger the party. We'll get to see any bit of the onslaught in action. So much for your help, everyone. It means a lot that you're willing to embrace these dangers with me. No time to lose, so let's get going. Now that I've lost my power, I won't be able to provide much practical support, but I can still keep an eye on the situation from here. Oh, but that's right, since she doesn't have a vision. So did she just fight her way to the top while visionless? It's actually even more interesting. I didn't think about that, but presumably that would have to be the case. Huh. Gotta be fair, I presume that there aren't enough vision bearers to make it so only vision bearers can ever win. That's unlikely if you encounter a situation that you can't handle. That won't happen. Mm -mm. I hope not. I feel like Yansen's being set up as Smerudia in that case, then. Frightening. You have to get out of here then. Careful out there, I'll observe the situation from here. Some kind of scrying, or... Hmm. Oh! Okay, so this just opens up. Okay. And we can't even go on there. It won't even burn me. Can't even go there at all. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, we got slightly different hangers for them. Didn't say all that much about their appearance, though. Underground or ruins? It's an entrance to the Night Kingdom. And it's... Oh, it's real close by. Okay. What is interesting is that the map description for Expedition says that this crater was created by some massive impact. Maybe it was the Genshin Impact, but no, in all seriousness, that might mean that this spot was where the nail for now one was dropped, maybe? That, that might be why Abyss uh, tries to show up here. Say what? The nail stuff? How would you know? There are lots of craters. And as far as we know, only one nail per nation. It's annoying that there's no way to cancel Night Soul mode while you're there. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, so we could actually use a Yung for source and they blow that up. Or we could just break it with Claymore, maybe? Me when I get impacted by the Genshin. Okay. Thank you. Feels good to be using Duke again. And okay. These are completely unbreakable without. No, you can't break them this way. Well, I. No Yunkasaur around here. Oh, wait. Mm -hmm. Let's go in. It, it did. Remnants of the Secret Source. Oh, Secret Source. That's the name for the mech enemies here, too, so I'm wondering what they mean by that. Sort of. Is the Abyss the secret source? Actually, I bet it is. Given that the secret source of Tom is power, power while you're in Night Soul mode. Presumably they're powered by Abyss. Because... Deshret Primal Constructs are powered by 
I believe, fragments of Celestial Nail and maybe Lingering Sealy Power from Nabu Malakata's Jin. And then Ruin Guards, Ruin Enemies are powered by... Okay. And Celestia Abyss Reactions... And what do you mean not behaving? Okay. Well, if it works, it works. Good luck. And Fontaine is powered by a worse word than that. So I guess pure abyss machines could work here, maybe. Remnants of the secret source, soul packed in that kingdom once home to ancient dragon kind, now reduced to ruins. Ruins to buy the abyss, the site harbors many unforeseen dangers. All right, we'll try this group. This grouping. Hmm. Search the ruins. Can't go any farther back that way. Got some interesting sort of Aztec style architecture there. So that's actually an invisible wall. Nice. These are. Okay, that just puts me in a cutscene. Oh, wow. Joint pain? Oh, right. If you want a good. Here's the secret to killing insects. You need a spray can of something. Cooking oil would work. And what you do is you take a lighter and you hold it in front. You have to be very careful. You can make a short range makeshift flamethrower. You can use that to kill insects, like wasps. You could probably maybe manage with sunscreen, because it's all about igniting the aerosols. But flamethrowers are how professionals get rid of things like wasp and hornet nets. Why not? You're just gonna run away and injure yourself again? Get one of those long handled lighters, even. The ones that you can hold and have a long barrel so you don't have to get anywhere you're close to the flame. Didn't you say you were willing to use weapons before against Mahoyo HQ? Were they bees or were they wasps or hornets? Because those are all very different animals, actually. If... If they're just trying to kill you, you, you can act in self-defense. I swear, you really are a prey animal. Maybe not one right now. It's not how I was imagining in this past. That was home to incredibly advanced civilization ruled by dragons. Oh, so that's what we got that dragon had. It serves your own society for the fall of the dragons. So these are Saurian ruins. Don't think she's talking about the Saurians. I think she means actual dragons. Well, if they're trying to sting you and kill you. Burn them to a Chris, and if they end up being bees, no one needs to know. I imagine there would be exceptions for reasonable self defense anyway. Read a book, I swear. There's not some sort of gestalt consciousness of every wasp in the world. There were different breeds of wasp anyway. Just if it's this much of a problem for you, just torture the damn wasps. The elemental sovereigns, they have their own advanced civilization. It's a really long time ago. Very few records have survived until now. So no one really knows what the devices were for. 
These ruins have been abandoned for a long time, but with the recent increase in this activity, the installations around here have somehow been activated again. Ah, so they're anti abyss They're saying is, we're not in for an easy trip to the Night Kingdom. No, it's going to be obstacle after obstacle from here on out. Uh -huh. Oh, then... You could literally exterminate all of the wasps. If they're a bunch of nuisance animals, you could just kill them all. No one would hold it against you. It's like killing mosquitoes. Don't tell me you feel guilty when you kill mosquitoes. Mosquitoes are, in almost all cases, some of the only animals with no biological niche at all. You're not even a pacifist. You're perfectly content to fight other people. Kill a wasp. If a wasp is trying to kill, you kill the wasp. But mosquitoes exist entirely as parasitic vectors of disease. They are not a meaningful food source or a controlling factor for anything else. Stupid. Go to bed. That's what I wanted to hear. A weapon like that? It's creeping Paimon out. It's the pre-adventure excitement kicking in, right guys? Of course I'm eager to get started. Just live for moments like these. Let's go, we won't let anything stand in our way. Continue deeper within. Some glowing lantern. That. There's literally an Aesop's fable about that. I'm not even kidding. It, it's, it's about a guy who saves a frozen snake and warms it up by the fireplace, and then the snake bites him. Yeah! It. You know, I, I wouldn't say. Get across, which way you can soar. Yep. Shame we don't have Keenich. Oh well. It'd be cool if this was an opportunity to use Keenich early. And build up your endurance. Goodness. Hold up. Trainer, warrior from the Collective of Plenty. And find out what's up with her. So that's saying actually work as a sports coach. Physical endurance for popular sports, not physical training, nutrition plans as well. Interesting. Mm. Two. No sugar, no soft drinks, no grilled meat. Oh, well. Oops. See, that's it now. Assemble out one by one, focus on what's good for you. Mm. Such as a green smoothie. Two of us might not see eye to eye. Actually, mm. I'm wondering how I'm supposed to get over there. Okay, good luck with all that. How am I? I guess I could just fly out and over, but oh goodness. This is going to suck, probably. Actually, Sadaragan. Don't know how I'm supposed to get out of here. One, two, and. Okay, you can't weave mid jump. Huh. So is it just a matter of trying to. Oh, okay. Right, because they can actually. Right, they can air stall infinitely as long as you've got full gist in. I forgot about that. I. Yeah, I haven't really used these ones much, so their abilities are kind of foreign to me. Okay, cool. Okay, so I'm stuck in the air. I got common chest. Go up here, keep grappling. Actually, it's like that. Oh, while we're in here, we've got... It's not infinite full gistin, but the other own stored up. Court of Resurrection activated. Mm -mm. Then we can just get by a little faster. Oh! And it's these abyssal saurians. Look familiar. 
Um, before, let's go show no mercy. Ouch. Take against Nakte. So I guess we can hop out here then. Probably a good idea. So we got Hydro and Dendro. Okay. Might be a bit annoying depending on the situation. Okay, cool. One, two, and well, all right, never mind. And hopefully it burns. Spread the burning. Yep, we got burning on all of them now. What that means is we can hit all of them like this. Okay, cool. Get that burning up. Come on, come on. Please, please. So we got that. Cool, cool, and burn, burn. Oh, goodness. Take that in. Okay, we need Emily stuff back. Some trouble recharging, that'd be fair. The only time I'd really want to use her, use her, but again, be on a true dendro team. Okay, there we go, and some of that. Oh, and right, spirit way, which means. Milani, I suppose, but to be fair. If we couldn't use Kinich there, I may as well actually use the dragons at least one time. Even do that midair. It's fun. It's the only attack they've got to stop on the spirit way. Thank you. Oh, so it automatically locks us in if we were close enough. And it activated like that seems really high up. Oh, so we can't see all of that at the moment. Hello there. Oh, now it's gone, gone. Okay, then. I, oh, we can use Split Kiss and keep this going, which means... Let's just send in Moroni. Yeah, we can use this to keep this going indefinitely. Even though it's rather strong. And... Right, and missiles. There we go. Ooh, we got a lot of you. But yeah, Milani will work very well here. Shimoku. So there. Right, and oh, uh, that hit. Right there. Get that off, and toss. We got you, we got you. As we stay over in a place where we can use. We're guessing we're chilling. This is our Milani. Come on. Right. It would be nice to put Kachina on here, I guess, but that will be fine. Right, and oh goodness, I do not want you to charge back up. Oh, please. Right, and okay. And then close, and that did kill. Good, and that vape. Yep. That might be it. Let's charge that back up. It. It's a nice feeling of strength, though, to be fair. She wants boss anyway, at least in theory. That up. See that focus go through there. It looks almost like a lion. But we and I. So, yeah, that's just typically Saurus. Broken fissures move swiftly and. Big focus and crystal with some weird abyssal corruption in that strange machine, ring shaped machine on top. Okay. Just enter that, or we could just use Kachina anyway. Oh, I can hop out whenever. That's fun. But of course, there's no reason to do that. Cause some problems for me otherwise. Hmm. In that case, let me just see something real quick. Okay. And so we'll enter. Goes up here. That's fun. Can't change our course, but it does let us go on that wall. Alright then. Simple enough. Oh, now we're still burrowing. Okay. That's right. I can do a little turbo troll like shockwave. It's fun. And we go back up. Right. So the one with an actual combo was a Yunkasaur. Interesting. But that's basically Turbo Truly mode, I suppose. Kinda. Kinda. 
And, yep, now it's out. These are full gifts for this. Come on, come on. Oh, but... Could I keep this going indefinitely with Sheena here? Maybe. I don't know. Who knows, really? Mm, Night Soul, but I'm pretty sure if we'll get some going to go to the field ourselves, so... Come on, fight, and... Oh my goodness. Let's try to avoid death. Because that's gone. We should solve our death up, maybe? Oh, come on. This is rather troublesome. Sure, we're in a range, and... That's actually pretty capable range for that, which is nice, and... Uh, Make sure it's out of the way, and... Okay, that killed. Good. Couple more hits, and... Bite! That... I didn't think that would hit, actually. For a second, at least. So, I think... We will... Put Kachina down and use... The burst... Oh, so that's... The burst the Gilded Drill Deck is actually her burst. I didn't even think about that, but it makes sense. I'm like, oh, well, that's death. That's sad. And... Someone needs a bit of healing, then. Hmm. Give her some health food. Back. Come on, come on. We'll give you a suspicious steak. Use on a fallen character. We got the limit there, which I think I actually decreased a little. Now let's bring you back up to full. The very hungry Milani. Ooh. Kind of stuck in a... Position real quick. Oh, come on. Luckily, we're decent where we are, but still. Okay, come on. Put that there and trigger to crystallize. Very, very good. And hit. And oh, we could have put you and Emily there too, but that will work. This is fine, too. Come on, come on. Well, let's actually blast you with the missile real quick. Thank you. I think be a little less durable now. I don't know how much the armor actually increases resistances, if it even does. But it really does have some issues with durability. Come on, we're quit fishing. And fight. We're just not quitting. Come on. And really, really? Oh, because we're... Let me see. Ah, uh, right, because it's only when she's actively in, entering the Night Souls Blessing State. I mean, only after you consume Night Soul Points, which means since we weren't consuming Night Soul Points anymore, just in the Blessing State because of... Because of Fulgestion, our crit went, went, rate went way down. Now I see. Now I see. Okay. That. Now I now I get it. But that's why they're still... You know, they're best in actual rotations, even if you can't use Fulgestion to keep it going. Resurrection activated. Another Tepet with Sor. That'll be fair. I wonder how well Kachina would actually work for this, then. That would be fair, I probably should not be using her. Oh, and you can just instantly break... Insta-break the Fulgestin Crystal ones. If you're in a... To pet we sort, but also just if you're a child of Echoes. That's fun. Okay. Though presumably it'd be limited to their Geo damage. That's the spot though. Final stretch. Need to climb up and we'll be there. Nothing to it. It's for you to say. Oh, because that's right. You have to indwell. I did not mean to do that. To indwell over here. To climb up. Yeah, because the Fulgiston crystals can be climbed up by children of Echo's climbing forms or by Tepetli Swords and I. Oh, they have an aerial move? I did not know that. That's interesting. Oh, well, it's just that. You can do it in midair if you want to, though, so... On this funny-looking pseudo-mountain. You know, I liked how they had us use various abilities, and that rock is... 
very similar to the rocks in the chasm now that I get a closer look at them. Hmm. Okay. This is the only thing we can climb right here right now. I'm very consistent with that, which is interesting. They regain that very easily, so there's a rift here. That's the real question now. I'm gonna take us deeper in. Oh, this is the actual abyss entrance. Must be the entrance power I've told us about. One ripped open by the abyss. Not to the abyss, but the night kingdom, which I presume is an adjacent area. In the depths of this place, it feels familiar, but also cold. No awful cut it out. Probably because Chaska has abyss experience. It's a bit abyss and a bit wild, but also different. We have to go in there. I guess so. Hey, Palma just needs to pike herself up. Psych herself. Pike. Psych herself up. Don't push her through before she's ready. Push her through. Oh, goodness. Oh, but another quest? Wait. Or... Hey, you don't have to drag Palma on your point too hard. Are we actually actually going to get a move around here, or... Cut this all. It's like we made it. This is the Night Kingdom. So she has been here before. I wonder if this is the entrance that... Well, given that the warriors knew it was up, that presumably that's the entrance they used to get into here for the fights anyway. There's ghosts of fallen warriors over there. Those vague shapes. So different from what I imagine in the stories, there's abyssal energy everywhere. Oh, so she hasn't been to the kingdom proper, or...? Wait. An overflow of energy and yet more rocks like in the chasm, like we saw outside. The flow of energy is prominent trust kitchen in here in the first place. From this point forward, everything we know about the real world no longer applies. Anything can happen here. I'm also more worried about how we're going to make it out. We obviously can't go back the way we came. See that patch of light on the ground? It's shining down from that fissure in the sky. Is that light to climb back out, I presume? Yeah, right in front of us. So that's coming from up there. Well, it's so high up. Really fall that far down. It's not really a question of physical distance anymore, is it? It's so like I said, our real world knowledge doesn't apply here. Fell all the way, yet came out completely unscathed. This was the real world, we'd have to climb our way back up to the entrance, but here all we have to do is stand underneath the light and offer a prayer. Hmm. That's it. Don't try it now, don't try to run away. Get eaten. You really think that would old Pama? Yes. It's not even my Pama. Yes. Like my story. So that means all we need to do is find Kachina and bring her to this location. Exactly, this light is streaming in from the real world to link between the two realms. The Enzuts of Sekai. Hmm, the terrain looks different to navigate and the visibility is not great either. I was supposed to find Kachina in such a pleasure. Conditions. Yeah, these floating black things don't look super friendly either. Kuroyatsu? These are all manifestations of abyssal power, be careful. Is that the guy from the Dendro tribe or ghost attacking ghosts? Look a lot like the ghosts from Surumi Island, actually. Calm down, I'm here to help. You're the ones who have the right? Does that mean you're the guy? But he can't get back, can he? I saw Vichama's must run Marco. I was completely lost to this realm until I sensed a mysterious power calling out to me. So it's a trap, not an actual afterlife. It's like it was seeking me out, attempting to reassemble the things of who I used to be. Of course, can only do so much. Sorry, I can only appear for you before you in this imperfect form. No, we should be the ones apologizing if the spirit speaker stone had become corrupted by the abyss, we could have done much more. We had to destroy it, otherwise Vichama and his tribe would have been in danger. Of course, thank you for protecting him, and I haven't really mentioned that. Even after all these years, he still takes such a risk for me. Under the power of the stone, it felt like our souls were connected. Turns out even our regrets were exactly the same. Whether in triumph or in death, you want your best friend by your side. So I'm alone as God being here. Exactly, that may not be in the cards for us, but it's not too late for you. You're looking for a young girl from the Children of Echoes, right? She's being chased by an embodiment of the Abyssal Power. Probably a rift to hunt. I'd like to help her while I'm still in this form, so follow me. Be careful, this place has been severely corroded by the Abyss. 
into eternal night. I didn't realize it had gotten this bad. Is the Mubo Kenny ready to up at any moment? Follow Malko, unexpectedly meet Malko, the friend Vichama is looking for in the Night Kingdom. Malko points you towards Kachini's precise location. Hmm. Kuroi Kaza. Seething black volcano. Okay. Now oh, we can keep on going. Wonder what. Oh, and now they're starting to. Try to. Ooh, my goodness. Can't go wandering off, it's too dangerous. Oh, okay, so it's just like. Sorush in sort of abyssal memory in the Harvest Tokum. It's all physical, so. At least for now, Abyss is definitely physical power. Which is consistent with what we've seen so far. But it does make me wonder if it's going to stay like that if we ever get. Abyss is an element, which we should eventually. Won't be able to keep this up. Let's try another route this way. Damn, it is strong, though. So we're actually hiding behind some of the rocks. Ooh, okay. And our ability to eye for them seems a little limited, because the tracking is ridiculous. Can't even go through there. What if I go out this way? He's still moving. Now he's waiting for us, but I just want to see if I went over this way, actually. Oh, but that's where I was supposed to head. Okay. Give me... Delicious lasagna, slowing pots and fire. You utilize the meat sauce essential to the pasta throne. The moment it enters your mouth, consistent with bliss on peril, the almost want to make today was Zanya Day. Huh. A fire's trail, fine tea, full moon. It's a tea, single crumb, tea pastry. When you have that wall, it means you can't go out that way. Yep. So in theory, you could run around. I doubt there would be any special dialogue, though. I don't know. Any fights here, or... Yep, okay. Saurians. More monsters, and... Every kind except Hydra shouldn't waste our time on them. Well, I think we gotta. I feel like it. I'm in. I'm in the mood for a good fight. Come on, and we can keep some of that going. I think. Come on. Guess we can put this down, but it means to recreate it level one. Sadly, thanks. Hit and. Over there in this, I suppose. Dendro ones are more mobile, but the homing is good, even though they do resist it. But the burning damage itself might help me here. Should hopefully. Oh, there we are. Come on. Thank you. Well, actually, that's right. Milani could. Milani could have helped out there. Just didn't even think about using her. Oh, but. So we had to kill them anyway. I didn't even think about trying to get him to move on, but I don't think he would have been able to anyway. Wall of light. Probably an invisible wall. Yet, see it from farther away, but not when you're close. Hmm. Glad that he's relevant again. Can't see anything. Got this miss. Is it a here? Just stick close. Inverse escort mission. We're getting escorted. So where's that monster? Just like a cutscene. Oh? Oh? Wait. Lots and lots of ghosts. Presumably they're the angry souls of those who didn't come back to life. Did you hear that? What? Soka? Your mom is probably just my imagination. Is your Paimon like that? Yeah. I heard it too. It was a voice from the abyss. Anything sin related or what did it say? As a matter, it certainly doesn't harbor good intentions. To eternal night, night keep following Malko. The journey lies. Uh oh, Paimon just heard it too. Yeah, presumably it's all about. We went the wrong way. Let's get out of this place. Oh, there she is. So we just gotta save her from some rift hands. Alright. Talk to Kachina. Okay. What is over this way? Oh, that's just the wrong way to get back here. Oh, that's fun. There are a few extra fights we can engage in. 
You know, always bloodthirsty. So, this down, none of you will take less damage from that. So let them keep up burning, not get rid of any of the aura. Because Milani would consume that very quickly. Come on. Okay. This going, I guess we can go for a few soul hits just to kind of keep them stunned, I suppose. That should work. And doing well there. Nothing resistant, but so a little able to hit them, which is nice. Yeah, I wonder if we go the wrong way, are we going to find anything in particular? Probably not, but still. Okay. Oh, and oh, more heal trolls. That's fun. Come on, come on. And get this down. And this is time for the burst, I suppose. Come on. One of them actually died to it, so. And. Go for the clone, clone, and. Big hit. Thank you. Okay. Keep moving this way, and it's just completely wrong, right? This is where we came from. Right, right. Ghosts are back there. Really do just feel as if. I'd like to see how many things there are in here. Expect we run a each of his friend, Malko, and the Night Kingdom. Malko points you towards Kachina's precise location. Yeah. Yeah, so there are extra fights we could engage in. If we wanted to be silly. And I did. So again, I like good fights. Bad ones too. Any fights. So is that hole in the rock, basically. Go this way instead. Show anything special? No, it doesn't seem like it. So here we are. Couple of Electro Rift Hounds around Kachina. Hello there. Hello. Oh, but she's getting corroded or Oh, something's coming from behind. Is it gonna be a big Rift Hound or? Oh, just more ghosts. Right, because it's a manifestation of abyssal power, though the wolf souls are really more their gold's creations. Wait. That happened. Oh, that didn't happen because we went the wrong way. It was just supposed to freak you out. We're here, Kachina. Rani, you made it. Mima? Everyone's there. There's a multiple people. So, I really have to wait until we take care of these monsters. Good idea. Let's go. Ashimo Tataka. Fight too. Oh, trial Kachina. Okay, defeat the Rouse monsters and yeah. Okay. That's our girl. Let's put this down and over a blast. Oh, right, we didn't get a bonus because it's not my artifact set, right? Okay, whatever. Come on, come on, and fight. Keep on going. The distance is fine. Well, let's go for this. Keep that vaporize up. Cool. Mm -hmm. Well, it leaves a bit to be desired, huh? And they're triggering overwoods on me, not good. Come on, come on. Oh, because of all the corrosion, right, okay. Come on. Might be it, hopefully. Talk to Kachina. Okay. Still point to him. So actually, presumably, we went the other way, maybe. Would he show up, or? You're here, finally here. Stopping. Asterisk, thank you so much. Nagato? Monster can appear from anywhere. It almost caught me a bunch of times. The wipe's power helped keep me hidden, so I just tried to stay out of sight until you got here. Atta girl, you did so well. You did your work. Most importantly, you weren't hurt. She was sort of heading back then. Actually, I have a request. We can visit the Wyab with me. Can't exactly put into words that something's wrong with the Ode of Resurrection. I know it's something new with the contamination from the Abyss, so could we try to fix it? That was the power of its theory as well. Everything we've seen here certainly seems to back it up. Mako and the Night King, their six main totem poles representing the Wyab of each shrine. You can think of them like the body of each Wyab. Digital totem poles, like the ones around here, serve as proxies in which the Wyab can extend their consciousness. So are the big. Black purple rocks. The obsidian, there were countless proxies scattered in the Night Kingdom. Clearly, the Wab can extend their consciousness over the entire realm and track down souls no matter where they roam. 
つけられるんだ Those rocks in the chasm, then. That is rather strange. <laughs> But I think then. Night s o n e might represent basically non evil abyss. But if a prophecy were to become severely contaminated, then a soul could become lost within the Nether Kingdom. Judging by the current situation, I don't think we're dealing with just one contaminated proxy. Even if we could draw back the Oath of Hell within one of them, that probably wouldn't even put a dent in the problem. Still, we can't just leave the lab to slumber. It's protecting the soul tonight, and saving one is better than saving none at all. Or even might even m a n a g e to draw a monster that's been hunting Kachina. Where the monster might help slow down the deterioration of the Nether Kingdom. Uh, arg. She's afraid or she's hurt. Chino, what's wrong? Nothing, just a headache and that voice again telling me to abandon the wild and leave this place. We really should weep, Kachina's already been here for too long, but that's exactly why we need to do it. As if the Abyss is trying to manipulate us. No, I'm fine. Don't plan on listening to that nonsense. I can hold on. Where's the totem pole? Step ahead, I'll lead the way. The sounds I can still fight, so please help me out a little longer. Takaya, listen to me, Kachina will come with you, but that's because we want to help the wild, not because we have something to prove. You don't have anything to prove either, it's okay if you reach your limit, we'll be there for you. Alright, the sooner we get this done, the better. We've already come all this way, so we might as well try to get to the bottom of this. Let's go this way. Stay here and try to stall the abyss monster. All by yourself, it's too dangerous. It's all right, I may not be as strong as that monster, but I'm definitely more familiar with the area than the size. You don't have much time left. If you're anything like my friend, I'm sure you're not particularly fond of goodbyes. So go, achieve your goal, and return to the world where you belong. Thank you for everything. Thank you, truly, for all your help. A wonderful hero, basically. Ah, thank you. And no one fights alone. Hmm. Reunion. Check on the wild. That's still hurt. Oh. Have you walk in the camp? Talk to him here. Wonder where that totem is. Thought I'm fine. She's not made of stronger stuff than that. Actually, can go down there, but no reason to. I don't have a map of this area. I really do wonder. If and when we'll get a truly explorable abyss map. Okay, lots and lots of non specialties getting used up right now. Okay, Tayaki. s h o u l d like a snapper. Just like my thought that said a rapper. I shouldn't show Kitty Meal, that's Kiraraz. Okay. So, a few more down there. Decent amount of regen. Big piece of obsidian. Mons Mib actually is the dark world from. Second, I thought it was damage, I was healing. The dark world from Metroid Prime 2 specifically. What if we went down here? Did they say anything to us? About going the wrong way? So actually, now I can. Oh, please. Oh, well. Someone's dead. Huh. That ain't great. So, does she have an empty belly now? Yeah, dying empties your belly. That makes some sense. <laughs> so, in that case. That obsidian totem pole over there, okay, it doesn't look like anything we've seen before precisely. And I guess those rocks are, yeah, just abyss rocks. And it has a pattern to it. Hmm. Okay then, presumably we're gonna fight something, probably try to purify this. That is, um, referring to like a person while I'm back. Friends are not here to heal you. So I probably gotta use my purification power again. Hmm. 
I have to do a QTE again? Wow, can you hear me? Wow. Tavesan. Great spirit of this land, agent of night's will. Hmm. Yeah, because presumably, there's not necessarily an evil will to the abyss itself. It's incompatible with the power of Celestia and arguably to elements, but that doesn't make it evil, just opposed. It's probably due to gold and the other sinners that it's aggressive in the way it is. Ultimately, it's just a power from beyond. Well, it's just quantum element. Nothing. So we were right. This contamination is already too severe. It's running the wire from answering our calls. If Kachina was calling, would you pick up? Right, get ready, everyone. That looks like a monster's viewpoint. You purge the abyssal energy from this place. I hope, too. Careful, we got company. Yes. Oh, a pyrolector. Already? Come on, you. Differently named. Pyrolector? So that name presumably means that he's originally from not one in some sense scorching star. You really think that puny soul could slow me down? Courage in the face of futility is pure folly. Hmm. So that's that monster. But I've potentially described it as a manifestation of abyssal power. Hmm. Tried to get in my way, so I disposed of him. Killed Malko. Masaka Marko? He would have dispersed with or without me. Rather than worrying about him, I would urge you to focus on yourself. You may have defeated others in my kind in the past, but underestimate me now and will be to your peril. Were you the one behind all of this? No, the power of the abyss is intoxicating. The destruction it seeks captivates like a master work of art. Strive only for the opportunity to see it up close. A mix of destruction. We thought this night girl was an exception, but it turns out humanity is full of lambs willing to offer themselves up to the slaughter. That is the tragedy of your short lives. You understand nothing of all encompassing power. Mm. I kind of thought that was Capitano's voice in the trailer, but Salon was in there too. Okay. Your names, pride, friendship, all empty ideas intend to give you a false sense of self-worth. It's just no power at all. The Pyrarchum create those grandiose ideals out of pure selfishness. Anything to avoid sharing power, anything to avoid handing over the primordial gift to ordinary people like you. What does that mean? Don't believe me, then ask yourself. Why is the Pyrarch and strong beyond measure while you can cheat and so pathetically weak? Presumably, it's the scheme set up by Celestia. I, I. Watashi. Kachina chan. Give me your hand. Oh? Aww. You know what? I'm right here next to you. Thanks, Moana. You're right. I have nothing to fear. Because I'm not alone anymore. Here's her team. Oh? You're right. Maybe comfort ideals don't have any power. But you couldn't also be more wrong. You never had to work for your own strengths. You will never understand the true source of our power. What are you saying? Courage we have to stand before you and not back down. It comes from our friendship. Power is not the ideal itself. And our commitment to upholding that ideal and our decision to stand together and fight. Well said. This girl Kachina should take more than two of us to handle an enemy like this. Sorry in advance, but you deserve what's coming to you. There aren't many enough to beat us when we're together. It's time to get a taste of that kind of power. Hmm. Defeat the Abyss Herald. Oh, so we got a combination here. But no healing at the moment. Should be good. Maybe. But neither of them are attack skillers at all, which is silly. It's the funniest part. 
So actually, I can use a knight. So I didn't even think about that, but yeah. Come on, come on. Keep on hitting. And two, three, right. You can take him more damage than I might like. Come on. Ooh, you're coming back and out of the way. I, ooh. Let's make sure we don't get hit by that. And big vaporizes. You know, honestly, probably best off just using normals. Normal normals. Yeah. Guess we could put down out of the way. Put down. Put down Milani stuff and try getting some crystallizes. There we are. One, two, three, and bite! And there we are. Cool. Talk to your companions. We won. We actually won. Got the. Got the. This job wasn't any, wasn't any stronger than the ones we fought in the past. Yeah. That's what it gets for underestimating you, too. Classic work at Chino. Absolutely fantastic. This makes me so unbelievably happy. Mm. I'm happy to Milani together. We really are unstoppable. <laughs> oh, what's happening? Uh oh. Oh, that ancient name is that. Who's? My ancient name is glowing, but I thought he didn't bring it with me. That's hers. And hers is. It's probably a projection from the room, but that doesn't explain why it's glowing all of a sudden. Done something to. Be worthy of it? Wait, does that mean you're. ascending, basically? Or is that the power that'll purify the totem? That was a bold move, diving headfirst into fire to save your friend. Especially in a place so overrun with abyssal corruption. Oh, so it's a manifestation of. That looks geo colored, kinda. Gold is interesting. I wonder if it's geo, though. It was supposed to be Milani's ancient name. But presumably it doesn't have to be limited to one tribe, maybe? The first thing you pulled off is really something. A big hammer. Yeah, I bet that's a Geo. It's only really giant, though. So that's sort of waking up these ancient warriors. Everything you said was exactly right. As isolated individuals who stand no chance against the power of the abyss. With a year's worth of scars and lots of unnecessary suffering, you can understand that from myself. The power of one's plan and as one, everyone has a part to play. Only then will we have the power to defeat the strongest of foes. Who are you? Kimiwa? Oh, this is giant Tupac. Tupac, oh, actually from the people of the Springs. From the people of the Springs, I fought against the Abyss during the invasion 500 years ago. Okay, so that means is that there's no Kohola store. You're as big. Very human proportion, though. The Blood Club War presumably means it would be. Maybe every tribe. Zero so got Nagobo and Kongamato from the Bay Club Wars, so there would be three more dragons mentioned. This Chubog notably fought without a soaring companion. But. Presumably, Geo. We don't need more Geo characters, do we? There's probably no Geo Dragon Balls, maybe. But then. Maybe Electro Dragon and Animal Dragon? I feel like we've got to see this have some information on what happened to the other sort of legendary story and companions, given that two out of the five of them are literal world bosses now. And that name before, we're the giant who saved all of that one. The giant hero. To be able to wake my words from an ancient name and to fully embody the aspirations of the wild. Mm. Name Emoja. It's basically family. Yeah, you shall unite Emoja, the tribes, and save that one from its impending doom. 
me. As long as the bloodstorm runs through your veins, even the tiny spark of steel against stone could ignite a flame. Its blaze will become one with our vision for not one. It's just kind of glowing. So, OMJ. QMJ. Okay, so it's basically an odd job then. Even amidst. Even amidst everlasting darkness, our bonds remain eternal. So presumably, then, Kachinas are the UTBT. Bonds remain eternal. Oh, and that night soul glow on her. Ah. What's wrong, Malani? So many memories, my brain was just full of everything he once knew. Oh, and she's got face hats? She normally have that. I haven't gotten a close enough look. So that's what happened. So you called that the... What do you mean? Did you just figure something out? 500 years ago, they first saw their requests facing now. But to say no one started all the way back then. We can go over the details once we get back, but you're over here longer than we have to. So you already know about this whole thing. No bits and pieces, but no idea Milani was also part of the plan. Sounds like something's going to need a lot of explaining, so we're going to say Milani up first. Oh, yeah, it's still corrupted. That was just an manifestation of the name. Guess it's my time to try purifying this, or... Oh, we're all sort of beaming it. They're sending in elements. Okay, Yansa on Electro, exactly. Could have seen a vision on her, though. They're basically forcing it out as we siphon it in. It's flowing, theirs is flowing towards, ours is flowing out. There we go, cool. Okay, yes. that should be enough. Why I want? Can you hear me? Hmm. Let's the land, hear a voice, Kachina, my dear child. Oh, okay, there we go. Great, well then, I'm afraid it's time to say goodbye. I just want to make sure you're okay before you leave. I can't afford to stay here any longer. Before we can afford to stay here any longer, just going to ask you why I bestowed an ancient name upon someone like me, but it's okay. I'll keep searching within myself for the answer. I'll never stop trying to improve my strength. One day I'll live up to the hero who saw me. We're already an outstanding in my child, my eyes, Kachina, no matter what happens. Huh? We're all my most beloved children. It has always been my honor to protect and nurture you. Your ancient name is just that a name. If your parents chose to name you Kachina, I also gave you a name, but it need not define you. Focus on who you want to be. You are already worthy of your name. Now you need only devote yourself to become a better you. The story of your ancient name is for you to continue. Just like your parents, my love for you will never change. No matter what the future holds. Thank you, Wild. Glad to see the Pyrocon's plan move another step to its completion. It's time for you to leave this place. The situation here is getting worse. So now, my children, save not one on behalf of all you hold dear. Yeah, we never met before Waya, but I just want to say... Thank you for encouraging Kachina. It was exactly what she needed to hear. Oh! Well, what's going on? An earthquake. Abyssquake. We're out of time. It's the power of the abyss. Quick, we need to run. What is this, Mario? Got seen her. Oh, and a Seelie is leading us out. Right. It's a Seelie. The Seelie opened the way for us. Seelie. Lantern here. Huh. We are the Night Kingdom. Okay. And, okay, that's not actual water. Here we are. It's coming. There's no way it's going to slow down when we're close to it, like any advancing wall in most video games. Oh no, it's not. can run faster than it, but not that much. You have to be at a full tilt sprint. So that was stupid. Oh, okay. Ah. Opening the sky is closing. Keep on running. Hurry or we'll be stuck here. 
Yeah, I don't think that getting touched by that would be a good idea. Okay. There's an invisible forcing us onto the corridor. Watch out for the falling rocks in the middle. Aku. I think it's slowing down a little now, maybe. And here we are on the light. Come on faster. Never make it. Oh, it's closing. Uh oh. What kind of town are we gonna pull off? Oh, and it's a big old electro punch. Fun. Ah, and a giga drill breaker. But Yonsen is presumably a poor I'm according to data. But in Traveltro, she was sort of a martial artist. So is it? Oh, uh oh, not good. Oops. So how are we going to get out of here, though? Where are we? Something's breaking in. Who is this? Oh. Big blast of light dissipating the shadows. And... Oh! Well, you know, that works too. Big guitar riff, you've done well. Yoko Yate Koreta, now come home. No, you could just punch the abyss open like that. Looks like she just... Yeah, it looks like she just punched it. Okay. Huh. We're back. We're back. Her organ saved us. She's not here. Inaizo. How did she regain her strength? Did she say she used it all? I only had a bitch who was holding on to her emergencies, or maybe it blew up the sacred flame. She's still in the speaker's chamber, and what we saw in it was just her consciousness. So it's conceptual? Saying her consciousness did all that. Every great despair power comes at a price. Coughing. Hmm. That's real terrible, Kachina. Just let me get to a doctor soon. Get back to the stadium. The power on set. She have a doctor waiting for us. Recommend getting a full checkup. Just make sure no damage gets left behind. Oh, my feels okay. What about you? Completely fine. But you all seem to be pretty well against the abyss. Let's get going. We'll share what we learned in the Night Kingdom as well. Right, the wild mentioned something about the power work on this plan. What is it exactly? I to explain everything. We're all a part of the plan now. Every move we make from here on out, we decide not one's ultimate fate. Sayusurunda. Huh. The Great Escape. Past and future. Look for Mubuika. Oh, the cornerstone of stars and flames, character level up material. It's probably going to be an ascension map for Pyro Traveler. So you got Blazing Flint Ore from Travel Reputation. Well, to be fair, both six ascension, six constellations. I presume that. Well, Constellation Unlock Items, say. Constellation Unlock Item, though to be fair, they're presumably hiding most everything here. Yeah, activates Constellation. Hmm. Past and Future, Temple of Pox, look for Mabuika, Mabuika's spirit enters in that kingdom at a critical moment to extract everyone. She seems to still be at the Speaker's Chamber, time to go visit her. I will find you no matter the distance. The boundaries trapping the pathfinder are shattered, and the light now pierces into the chaos of darkness. I wonder if that rift is basically going to stay open now, then. Sort of permanent way into the Night Kingdom. Maybe. Hmm. Well, that might be a challenge location. Maybe. Come on, come on. Scone, we can use Milani, presumably to get the rest of the way with Night Soul Transmission, and did not mean to do that. Just like this, thank you. And 
starts with a bit more of her stuff compared to Pachina in terms of Nightsel transmission. Probably because, well, five star, there's just four star. Let's just hoof it. Okay. Set off to climb up. What a great way to get up there. Not that I see at least. I can find it eventually. Let's go out. Actually this. That's over there and I to get up here. Okay. Oh and that yep, that does burn me, right? Annoying. Oh come on. Vaporized. Oh, please, please. Come on. Come on. This. Speed things up a little. At least a little bit. Thank you. There we are. Well, not really. And we'll go in here. We'll crew Vavuika in the chamber. Vavuika's office. Hello, then. You are back behind here. And oh, with Cheska's sister. Hello. Oh, there's a lot of stuff here than before. Oh. Presumably she used up all that sort of power of memory associated with them to break us out. Let's get a seal here in one piece. Okay, let's have a lot of questions about Kuiku check you over first. Let's not let any lingering effects in the abyss and you are treated. Thank goodness you made it back. I came here as soon as the power Argon told me about your plan. Take a seat, everybody. We'll examine you. <coughs> we'll examine you one by one. Despite the short stint in that kingdom, Milani and the others are all some degree of abyssal contamination. It's definitely purifying the abyss. Oh, okay. Thanks to Kuiku's extensive experience for any visual contamination, the harmful effects will not be permanent. Treatment also reduces Kachina's symptoms. Yes. Alright, that should do it for now. But just to be safe, I'll perform another checkup in a couple of days. I have to say, though, I've never seen anyone react to the abyss like you, Traveler. It's like you're completely immune to its power. It's always been special like that, can even purify its power. Now that you mention it, how about the she's affected either? We don't know why, though. Maybe yeah, because we're. Descender. Abyss, I mean, Celestial associated, presumably. Some people say that Paman might be the eighth Gnosis. Secret eighth element. Given the current situation, that ability will likely play a great role in the events to come. Of course, I saw patients as he still had out. Thank you, Kuiku. Mm. Alright, alright, we might not see our own, but we have good intentions. <laughs> Just give it time, I'll sure we'll figure out things between us one day. Yeah. Alright. What's about your plan? Hmm. All right, there's so much to discuss. I don't even know where to begin. You've seen it for yourselves now. Devastation in the Night Kingdom. I'll get straight to the point. Not one is on the verge of destruction. It's very possible our nation is less than a year before total devastation. Huh? No, that can't be true, can it? Less than a year. Well, good thing that that's how long it passed like a wax. That's right, but I've only ever disclosed that fact to the handful of people working with me to save the nation. Our looming destruction is not a recent development, but the conclusion of the disaster the Abyss initiated 500 years ago. Malani well, told us a little bit about that. 500 years ago, all of the nations of that were invaded by the Abyss. Like the other nations, not one has never had stable and deep-rooted oil lines who have suffered the worst of the invasion. Why is that? <laughs> Assuming something to do with the dragon? The battle against the abyss was exceedingly long and brutal. In the end, the victory came to the gods of our civilization and countless lives. Mm -hmm. 
Civilization. The been done took centuries of solving the disasters caused by the abyss to finally achieve the peace we know today. Still, this is but a superficial victory. The forces of the abyss have merely been driven back underground. But denial remains as real as ever. I'd never have guessed. The problems plague in the Arctic never all the more complicated because that realm is essentially functioning as not one's ley lines. In the way after the war, our calculations estimate that we would have a maximum of 500 years before the Night Kingdom was completely lost to the abyss. But at that time, we were a nation of the destitute, where people no longer believe in victory, nor do they hold hope for the future. Our civilization was dying, our faith crumbling, and the line of power passing down from the wild nearly severed. If we didn't bring the nation back together, it would be foolish to even dream of defeating the abyss in the future. So the Archon had a long involved discussion with the heroes of each tribe, and finally came up with a 500 year long plan to save not one. So that's what happened. After finding Kachina, I encountered a strange figure who gave me a series of new memories. Since the plan was mentioned, those memories, I guess, have been chosen to play an important role in it. Now that's why the two boxes of Catalyst is basically kind of full of her. There's still something I don't understand. Those numbers showed me the power arc from back then, and it was you. Oh, but that doesn't make any sense. Power Archon is supposed to be human, it's impossible for a human to live that long. That's right, the hardest thing for humans to overcome has always been time. We have the natural limitations of our lifetime. So is she 500 years old, or... A god can extend a human's life by using a certain amount of power powers, checking them to a curse. Fear me not. But as we all know, not one does enough gods like that, can only rely on our own methods. A human life is like a flame destined to be extinguished. Ah, 500 years ago, I placed my life within the sacred flame. I would guess her family is long gone. Only by dying before my time could I have the chance to wake up again. So, in other words, this is your second life? That was all part of the plan. Yes, we only managed to defeat the Abyss all those years ago because the tribes came together as one. But not one of the future was to have a fighting chance. The power organs that came after the war had to rebuild the decimated tribes. So does it just keep resurrecting as the weaker, or...? Is she back, or...? Then her job maybe was to... Be the fighter at the end. The goal is to reunite the people and restore the strength of each chap's Wyob. Once a tribe was back to its full strength, the tribe's Wyob would select a hero, making the tribe was once again ready for war. Chosen within stand on the side in defense of our nation, just like great heroes of old 500 years ago. It means I'm one of the chosen. But Animo is another question. Maybe. It's right, you bear the ancient name Amoja. If someone held by the hero from your tribe 500 years ago, it means unity. If you're adventure of the Night Kingdom, I trust you've come to fully understand the meaning of that name. So, in other words, you always knew who had what or wanted to pick from each tribe. Yes, according to the plan, each tribe was supposed to be fully restored by the time I awoke. Okay, and right. So, there have been other ones, but she's been the Ark of Twice. Something went wrong al alone along the way. The six years successfully inherited the ancient names from 500 years ago that the intel were going to plan was passed on to them. So again, it comes down to the deterioration of the Night Kingdom. The between the sacred flame and the wine of the sacred box. Just like how the old of resurrection failed to bring Kachina back. Exactly, this is another tactic the Abyss is using against us. This may not possess intelligence, but its methods certainly are easy to counter. Want to unblock the information from being passed on, my presence only isn't enough. Each name bearer must establish a greater connection to their name. Hmm. So I've tried my best to help them from the sidelines. Currently, Shuanen, the children of Echoes, King of the Sons of the Canopy, and Yon Sun, the Collective Pony, have all been acknowledged by their names. Okay, so. Kachina is not the hero. And then once they're all their wit, they're all wit, presumably. Unless this is. This is symbolic, this is probably just symbolic. Maybe that gets the weaker her power back? Mm -mm. Kunich, Jionen, and Yansan. And that. To be fair, it doesn't entirely represent. I guess it kind of represents the Yunkasaur. Maybe. 
No, no, this is the Yunkasur. Because the Electro ones are battle-like, I believe. This one is kind of battle-like too, though. You venture two, you two are maybe no ultimate in your one, and the one, and across you gain the memory sword within your name. You will laugh in that. Just gonna end. Is it tomorrow, maybe? But we have less than a year. Yes, but we have no choice. We cannot start the planning until all the heroes have been gathered. It's also why I haven't been able to take action, despite the urgency of the situation. But if you knew this the whole time, I didn't just tell you that I roll all this, and then make everything go on faster. <laughs> Perhaps, but the opposite could also be true. Knowing your destiny too early could mean failing to realize your full potential. So like your determination to save Kachina, hope your commitment to this and endeavor comes from a strength of will rather than a sense of obligation. Suppose you're not going to tell us who the final two heroes are then. That's right, their time is yet to come. The pressure on them before you will only hinder their development. What if they don't make it in time? You only trust in the judgment of the Lyob. I never believe I could solve this crisis alone. In fact, it was for Salsa because I chose to trust and rely on others that managed to get this far. Not when salvation was not its archon, or any single individual, but in its all. Does that mean you? My perspective on you, I found it might get away with avoiding the topic. Huh, all right, all the stuff he stored here before. Where did it go? He's used up. Even though I sacrificed my power, I still needed to continuously plan and ensure you would make it back from the Mad Kingdom. After all, I was the one who allowed you to take that risk, and Milani has an important role to play in my plan. In addition to their sentimental value, the items I stored here have a much more important purpose, fuel. Fuel, so back then, that's why you were able to break it open. Consuming that power of memory. Yes, the stories embodied by those items are certainly important, but there is an even more significant trait they all share. Every item belonged to a hero of not one. Every time, they became imbued with a certain amount of contending fire, compared in battle. Yes, so contending fire is her power. Source her power of the power of the sacred flame, which is her life force. So only now when people would create it, it's... Basically Night Soul itself, maybe? Um. On their own, each item's power is limited, but together their combined power can be quite useful in a dire situation. In burning those items, I was able to activate the contending fire sword within them to open the balance between the two worlds. It was a rather quick approach, so all the power depleted in an instant, as you can see. But one of their precious treasures is one of their stories. It's exactly like Dry Duel here. No matter what, I never want the Pyro Archon to have to use that power. So sorry. I have nothing to be sorry for, you all deserve my thanks, actually. If you hadn't saved the totem pole, that area of the Night King would have been forever lost to the Abyss. Forever. Then it would only be a matter of time before the Children of Echoes were met with disaster. Besides, when those heroes entrusted the longings to me or the Pyro Archon of their time, it was out of desire to contribute to Nala's survival. They knew it from to use this fuel. They knew those items of the of the present heroes and not they would not mourn their loss. Even when you put it that way, I still feel bad. Yeah, there's no need to remember I told you about time. People and events of the past were never truly lost to us. So we carry them with us in a different form, and that sense we didn't lose anything at all. We still have regrets, and fuel your resolve in the battles to come. Your deeds will become new legends and nurture new forms of power, just like the items in the story here. I well, would still like to return the favor. Ah, if that's the case, just treat me to a drink sometime. Now that Kachina has returned, we can finally hold the victory feast. So about your team's trump and the night warden wars. You can all use the rest, that's for sure. This will be able to silence every reality once and for all, Kachina. Still, now that I know the danger we're facing, having a victory feast doesn't feel right. Try not to what it gets you, it's important to stay calm. Right about it will only affect your judgment. Alright, should head out, I'll join you in a bit. Hmm. New cutscene, or...? Okay, it's just model. You gonna dream? Yeah. Ah, flashback? Ah. This is in. Sea rocks. Oh, and this? Huh. Big sun wheel. 
<笑>ユーノの子を人前に置いて、ユーノの子を人前に置いて、ユーノの子を人前に置いて、ユーノの子を人前に置いて、ユーノの子を人前に置いて、ユーノの子を人前に置いて、ユーノの子を人前に置い
then presumably, yeah, the reason why Stanley's soul could not normally return to the ley lines is because not one doesn't really have ley lines. There certainly has not close for Akon Kalunga. Such a lovely sound. Now, Ron, I won't fight so long. Zombie. So what's next? Is the feast actually going to be something we experience, or? It's not like I've gone here. The rules are my legacy. Shall grant us the strength to overcome the next tragedy? Yeah, that's Shibalonke. Warforged, this... Or not, no, it's Wabs. Warforged, the six tribes, taught us to fight. How to fight and still miss what it means to love. Who will be the one to bring this to an end? It's gotta be her. Well, us. We are the inheritors of memory and legend. Those who grow alongside sun and wind. Those who forge our own destiny in the future. Is now inspire the lifeblood of our nation. This is the start of the quest. Doing the Oda of Resurrection. Hmm. Yeah, that has to be the explanation for the Stanley stuff then. And the banquet at the end? Okay, it's just over there, and... Now it'll be empty now, right? I presume. Can we go back in that room now, or is it locked off? It's not locked off, but it is empty, and oh! They even think about it, but that, the fact that it consumed... The picture of her family. Oh, wow. Well, you know... Happens sometimes. Okay. Just want to see then. Milani's night soul and yeah, it does give her those face marks, the face tats. Okay. Up around to the end then. And oh, we can go on the upper level. Okay. Oh, that's him, Bomb. Guy from before. Oh, well. It's trying to keep us on ground, but... Interestingly enough, that did not actually get Kachina wet, so the vehicle protects her, actually. Interesting. Maybe because it's a separate object, or... We're coming for the victory piece, too. Oh, no, and your chest would be here, so I just came to over some medicine I was about to leave, actually. It's not that I don't want to sell the Kachina and the others, I'm so glad she made it back, it's just... I'll make things awkward if I'm around my sister right now. Oh well, you two out of thoughts, so Palma can understand. She didn't cause any trouble during your trip, right? Of course not. She was super helpful, she gave us a lot of useful information about the abyss. It's good, that's all I needed to know. So is her sickness? Is there a reason you ask? Pretty outspoken when we first met. Now it's like you're holding something back, you can tell us anything. Maybe it seemed unreasonable picking that fight with her before you went, but I did it for a reason. Her impulse to fight is extremely strong. Her mental strength helps her rein it in. She still loses control sometimes. I had no idea what you might face in the Night Kingdom, so I didn't want to take any chances. So what you're saying is you devoutly provoked her, should she take that impulse out on you? Okay, so maybe it sounds a little stupid, but it works pretty well. It helps her keep her cool for a little while at least. Anyway, I'm just glad you're able to make it back safe and sound. That's all I wanted. But do you really have to go that far? Can't you just talk it out? No way, Chelsea never opens about her, about her own pain, especially for her family. She can't worn about this, or it'll be even harder to help her. Susan, thank you for confiding in us. ありがとう。ありがとう。まあ、そんなに心配する必要はないわ。どうにか方法を考えて、お姉ちゃんの負担を私も背負うから。私も背負うから。じゃあ、先にスレスレはね、楽しんで。うん。オーライ。オーライ
Ah, who would have thought there was a deeper reason behind their arguing? Shall look out for each other in their own way. We said that in there. All the Abyss's small pumps had enough of that move. Enter the inn. Go in the inn. Machina. Xenoblade. Okay, okay. Oh, and it's Paco from the Children of Echoes. Good to see him again. He's dancing. And who else is going to show up? Let's get a huge round of applause for our brave young Rory Kachina. Aww. Woohoo. Well done, Kachina. Thank you, everyone. And Kinichi is here. Thank you, everyone. I'm so glad I finally made it. I always knew you could do it with so much potential. You have a great future ahead of you. You're one to tell us. Like I didn't know you were the first person to abandon your team. I'll be dealing with you when we get back. Mikro, I had no choice. A friend invited me. I couldn't just say no. But really? So you weren't just trying to get ahead in the first round? Wasn't I swear? I just happened to find that bearer injured in the wild. I stopped to bandage his wounds. And he insisted on repaying the favor. What was I supposed to do? I'm just one person. I figured Kachin would have no trouble replacing me. Nope. The fact of the matter is that after your departure, everyone else started thinking about swapping teams too. If we started Kachin, it was wrong to abandon you like that. It's amazing that you still made it all the way through to the night water wars. That's the highest honor. So what about you guys? Did you make it far? And our team captain drank too much the night before the competition and turned away to the state of the day, and we got disqualified. Just desserts. Serves you all right. No sympathy for me. All right, all right. It's no need to be like that. Paka oji san. To your friends, I'd like to say a few words. Firstly, I'm grateful to my friends and our great Arkham for helping to bring me back. This traveler and his companion Palmon are some of the strongest people I've ever met. They were allowed to participate in the pilgrimage. I have no doubt that they'd win the whole thing. They've agreed to let me learn from them. With their help, I believe I can become even stronger still. Let's not forget my good friends Mawani, Shaska, Kinich, and Yatsan. I'll help the traveler and Palmon figure out a way to bring you back from the Night Kingdom. So, are we going to be the final hero, or...? That's the question. They too deserve to be called their heroes, so please give another round of applause for them. Thank you so much. Well said. Well said. Oh. Ami um, Kenish did not show up at all. Drink to that. Heyuni Kampai? A drink to the hero. How does it feel being a hero, Kachina? To be honest, it's a bit overwhelming. It just all feels so surreal. Well, you better get used to it and accept undefeated champion. And we're also become a champion coach. Please don't make fun of me. And talk to Novika, who is over there. Okay. Apologies, knew more than I would on. If it comes at a price, most heroes aren't people who set up to become a hero. If you're too tied to your goal, you end up losing things that are far more precious. But in any case, we're now on the same page. I wonder how long before the two final heroes appear from the far of the clan, the masters of the night wind. Probably Chaska. Then... Cryo or... Farfather is supposed to be Paro, but they're supposed to be An Animo, so... Hmm. That's my question. Okay, so he just repeats what he said just there. Okay. Couple of dinosaurs. And do you got anything to say? Not Paco. Moani is not here right now. Or, oh, she's right over there. Kachina. Been through so much all at once, everything still kind of feels like a dream. Are you still feeling unwell? Nope, all better now. Yeah, I told you I bounced back pretty quick, so don't worry about me. I bet you guys must be tired though. Make sure you get some good rest tonight. Got a recharge, so we'll be in the mood to have fun. But, you know, Hutao's teams might not be all that damaging compared to other options I've got, but the durability is actually crazy. Now that she's become a bit more useful now. Oh, and what's the same here? At previous victory feats, you always found the crowd singing and dancing. But after what I found out today, it's too much. I'm still trying to process it. 
Well, Suki, it's too big. It does feel weird seeing you sound of sorts. When it's false and sent to the right, it's important to try to enjoy moments like this when they come along. It's another cruel wisdom based on your adventuring experience. Well, oh, Pummet agrees. If you travel where everyone's coming together to celebrate your chance achievements, it's gotta be a first. Hmm. You're right, Kachina looks really happy, and now I'm being the moody one. You have doom and gloom, time to shake it off. Oh, so now she goes in. That's fun. All right, Kachina, let's party. I'm a little embarrassed. Don't be. Come on, you're the star of the show today. Cute. So, we got Yansan and Chaska. It's gotta be Chaska. It costs us a lot, but we are Kachina back seat, and that's what matters. There'll be even tougher challenges coming our way in the days ahead, though. We'll have to train hard and make sure we're in peak condition. For Zupamon, if you have special one-up sessions showing the ropes interested, no thanks. Chaska's here. It's rare to meet travelers as strong and brave as yourselves. I raise my glass to you. Anyway, my sister's already got back to her tribe. She has patience to treat, and we can't go there yet. It's not on the map yet. Well, we actually ran into her on our way here, and oh, well, Paula just thinks she really cares about you. Yeah, I'm planning to visit her myself in a few days, tell her and the rest of the family that they need to be extra careful. So hope they'll take it seriously. They'll tell them that the place are going to blow up. This is likely since your arrival in that one by now, so exercise caution on your adventures as well. She's over there. Is anyone up top? Well, we've talked to all the relevant playable characters for now. Hi, Thumb, Via. Tinari Koe. And. Sano did not show up. Sandio. And Dori. Pretty similar. And Ahida. So a few more playable characters showed up. Samara compared. Winnie, Monette, Fremine, Nuviet, Fiorina, Navia, Corinne. I think Fontaine had the most introduced in its cast that early on. Well, ah, you're here, have some fruit juice, got it especially for you two. Oh, and Charlotte, too. Fontaine introduced so much of their cast so early. How did you know? That's Pamela's favorite. You look like you've still got questions asked away. Well, Pamela convoluted, why didn't get here as a past to join you in this age? We needed to build things back up, so they had their own lives to live. Thought of telling them that you've been your families and everyone you love. Come with me to the end of time. End of time. For 500 years, not will be destroyed, it seemed too cruel. Cool. But just as easy to point out that everything in this world would come to an end eventually, Life is short and beyond the point, it just doesn't seem real. Imagine if I said it's will leave right now and go save the sun, because it'll flame out in a few million years, it sounds quite ridiculous. But the concept existing in that one is in in Tibet is interesting too. Not have expected that. Their old signs that could make that shoulder that burden with me. Mm -mm. Besides, every generation will have its heroes, this one included, the plan could still work without them. Or of course without me, since I was the one who came up with the plan, I felt the duty about to see it through to the end. Might suddenly remember that portrait in your room, was that your family from back then? Yes. Yes, it was, so when you asked me who my sister to be, the truth is that very little information survives. From what I've been able to piece together, I conclude with a reasonable degree of confidence that she ended up as an architect and artist. Gifts, so. Art. She played an instrumental role in rebuilding the signs of the Campy tribe, designing and building many houses. But of course, none of the crew buildings are around anymore. So it was an impressive achievement, and I'm very proud of her. That's the life you had to leave behind. If you lost Kimui, it seems her feelings were right in you. This is something I've long come to since come to terms with, so... Does Lui mean... Oh, Lui's still alive. She was in that past quest. This is a war, and there can be no war without loss. I'm already far more fortunate than those who lost their lives to the abyss. Hmm. People of not one look to me as their oracle, and the weight of their expectations is mine to bear. I see your fate through to the very end, no matter what I may find there. It's actually one to ask if you are already aware of fate. That doesn't mean the way everything ends has already been written, including your plan. 
Suppose, but so what? Don't forget, time and space make past, present, and future coexist and all are equally important. Presumably, maybe they lose, except for the fact that we're here. But the narcissism is a variable outside the plan, unpredictable. Even if the future ends in destruction, there's still no reason to give up on the here and now. It's precisely because we cannot know or think that we'll never give up on our struggle. This is a pivotal moment, we are still two heroes short. A three to be precise is one further hero who I'm hoping can get on our side, whatever it takes. Surely don't mean me. The resistance to the corrupting power of the Abyss is truly remarkable. Easily make you an all important figure in the upcoming battle. If you agree to join us, you will not only gain my full support in your journey, but also forge a brand new ancient name for you. Ancient names can be forged. And several strict conditions must be met. They couldn't be forged at all. A number and then in circulation would have long dwindled to zero. Assessing an ancient name would mean that your adventures in Melon are recorded in full. Stories are remembered by our people for all the years to come. The ode of resurrection may have lost its power, but still, take this as my personal guarantee that I shall never let you fall. Oh, so she taken out now, or? Just like in the Night Kingdom, I will be there for you. That is a promise, I will fulfill what I'll promise. This nation always honors its heroes. You have to promise me anything, I just want to help out the people. We can't just ignore the situation here. It's gotta be Shibalong, okay? Wonderful, then I'll reach out to Shionin right away. She's the one who will forge the name. Never forge an ancient name for an ally with me, but I trust she'll find a way. Mm, okay, black stone under a white stone. So is that showing the ancient name? Or? Oh, fought with Gabatama. So then who's who's the mole? Word, we received word that the power rocket has lost most of the power. Although your injury complicates things, this is most certainly the opportune time to seize the gnosis. And where is he? Captain? Victory and defeat are rules, not outcomes. I've never taken advantage of an opponent in time of weakness, and I don't intend to start now. He's so cool. As for you, I must confess. I'm not expecting that I will trick of yours to save the day, and that's over. No matter how dense the fire, as long as the sun remains, we cannot turn day into night. Could have dispelled it, she simply chose not to. Mm. You don't have much time, and you're injured on top of that. What do you plan to do next? I'm beginning to see just how useful you can turn out to be. Oh, I'd bet that Olorun is one of the heroes, too. And that he's gone in his memories, but somehow prevented Mubuiko from learning? Question is why he'd want to act as a mole. Probably because you... Other due to caution or knowing something the rest didn't, probably thinks. That it has to be cooperation between Mubuiko and Capitano in order to... Make it work. Order to defeat me a bit. You heard something from here, didn't you? From here. Oh, we're from his injury? Hmm. An avant garde graffiti visionary. Children Echo's dance event. Huh. So the event can happen now that focus experience mode has ended. Alright. Trouble Chronicles, hang out of that, yada yada. Got a new item too. That should be in quests, I believe. Or wait, character development items is that in here or? Ha! Huh. Yeah, it's with all the weekly boss mats. Oh, that's interesting. But it's at the end of the boss mats, but at the sort of ascension mats. So it's actually, it might just be the first and probably only five star ascension material. Heroes ignite the cornerstone of stars and flames. Sounds like the traveler in Bara mode. Heroes ignite the sacred flame, illuminating the world. And eventually they shall rest nestled among the stars. 
Now left behind a stone of weaving. This is our, these are our foundation. We have erected an everlasting civilization. Huh. And yeah, we can complete remain these with the rewards. And that's just a few more primos. We could do this. Oh, in a domain. Okay. Hmm. We can do that. We should actually get that started. Sap. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow we could probably get Milani's quest done and then do the event as well. Might be a good idea to. Well. Mm -hmm. Much to consider. Hi! And anything else to say first? Or something else you'd like to ask? Ah, there we go. Are the captain's whereabouts? Well, our intel suggests he hasn't made any movements yet. Though Kinish's investigation helped us confirm that he's been aided by someone from the Masters of the Netherlands. Okay. Orun has got to be the hero, right? I bet. I'm getting closer here and who that may be. But it's still unclear whether this person is the captain out of willingness or coercion. If you learn anything about this during your adventures, please let me know. Something else you like to ask? Elemental energy in the abyss, new gore. The abyss is the most formidable enemy in all of the In the beginning, it took failure and tragedy to even begin to learn how to fight back. Yes, the abyss. All the methods you've seen in other nations have developed based on experience and insight passed down over generations. We know them to work, but few of us actually understand why. It's the same for the method we use here in Mount Long. Ever since ancient times, elemental energy has been one of the most reliable weapons against the abyss. As for the principles behind it, I'm afraid you might have to seek answers from someone older than the disenchanted pyro archon itself. Some else, something else you want to ask? People not in other nations, there we go. That also comes down to the long-standing effects of the abyss. Their people's survival is inextricably tied to the Lyar. But their power has its limits. They cannot offer our people the same protection outside our borders. In fact, people who do decide to leave often suffer from memory loss and emotional issues. Can't believe this is just Hollow Knight. Everyone in Nolan understands this. This is why our people never leave without a good cause. Even if someone is left with no choice, the chief of the crowd must seek approval of the Wyatt to grant them leave. The Wyatt have always been very strict about granting that approval. It's extending protection behind our beyond borders. It's consuming power reserved for a fight against the Abyss. So there's no need to worry. The Wyatt have extended protection all within Nolan, including visitors from afar. So I have to ask... Okay. All then. Just repeats that, but. Capitano and Oron, not saying much about elements yet. People don't leave because the wild goes away after that. Dimitra was trying his brain, glass. Okay. So it's just repeating stuff here. Okay. Hi. Safely. One half session. Okay. That's all done with. Hmm. I feel like it has to be Oron. Well, if other clan, the master of the night wins. I feel like that mention means heroes got to be Oron. If he's that hidden. Actually. Ah, <coughs> oh, choking. Kachina, Milani, Kinich, Mavuika, Yansan, Chaska, Capitano, and Oron, and though we don't see him, have seen eight so far. Okay. Much at once, second dream, feeling unwell, better now. You would have fun. Okay. And. It's party, little embarrassed. Start the show today. Okay, so her dollar doesn't change, but some other she's moved. She moves based on what Milani does. Okay, cool. So that quest, but also you'll go around and beat up a few store form warriors. I've also got I wanna farm a few more artifacts from here. I want a decent set for Kinich, so also 
What is in here right now? Mmm, that's for Kachina. So we got farm some for Kinich tomorrow. Maybe. Huh. Tuyok Springs. Kawatapek Waters, Basin of Numbered Flames, Tecumacon Valley. Hmm. So then go in here, use that Winnie team. Yeah. Good stuff. Well, just about playing pirate as best as possible. Maybe Zhang Wing and multiple animal? Maybe. Mm -hmm. Eh, this is good enough. It's not that deep. Okay. Thank you. Maybe you're already starting off. Thanks. Cool. Hit. And. Smack. And. Blast. And. Okay, come on. And, yeah. Actually, getting batted in for. Just spamming his burst hits. Rapid application is probably bad. Maybe. Cryo bonus. Ooh, okay. That's going on Kachina. Now that. That's Kachina food. Well, in a bit. Cool. Look at that. Oh, rushing in. Swear that. Getting a bit closer. I. Mm, it's a bit tough, honestly. I. Oh, yeah, they're getting hit weirdly. Ants. Then it ends. Come on, come on. We, as long as we stay in here, we can get lots of application. Well, I. Alright. Ants. The swirls are. Such a good way to do it, just because you can apply as much as you want and it'll fill up the range gauge. Okay. Hmm. Synergetic, so that's good. Eh. Yeah. But. She wanted uh, not to say too much, but she is gonna almost certainly using Cinder City. Hmm. hmm. Okay, Sethos. Eat it. Eat up. Should probably start leveling stuff for. Well, just getting stuff for Keenage. Since he is in a couple short weeks. Okay. Well, we're getting nice. Closer and closer to. Usable Sethos, so to speak. Come on, come on. Said I. Honestly, not really all that sure how much I have to use. Okay, come on, and then it, then it, and come on. Thanks. Oh, right, because the. He has the. Forgot about the infusion. That's. The one time the infusion would actually be useful, I forget about it pretty much completely. Alright. And, uh, not great. Not great either. But. I don't want to be in the business of just tossing stuff like that right now. Okay. Then we swirl, get them all in. Thanks. Swirl again. Get it. And yeah. Go for another quick hit. And then it, then it, then it. And. Yep. Honestly, maybe just save then it. Okay. Alright. So I think that'll be all I need to form at the moment, and ah, that sucks too. Good mm -hmm. Cinder City set for Shion and the other hero. I was kind of wondering if Kachina would be a hero, but the fact that she isn't seems to suggest to me that all the heroes are going to be pop stars, which makes sense. I believe 
we even five star Yansan. Okay. So in that case, I think. Condense a bit more resin so that I can have stuff for tomorrow and then. Maybe get started on the. Mm, we gotta go around finding warriors. That's what I'll do. Take down a bunch of sword form warriors. Mm. Don't have much time left. Well, I could try fighting that between power agent boss again. I like that idea. Hmm. That's just the team I'm going to use. I honestly think I'd like to use the Hytham team. It's so great. Right, right, blackstone under a white stone, complete blackstone under a white stone. Okay. Hmm. Should be good. So we see how well they do here, actually. All these guys down. Hello, hello. And thanks. And put this in. Thank you. Just like this. And put that down. And oh, somebody's missing. Good deal of stuff. Well, all right. I have to find another way to gain that back then. Sentry whistles. And that's funky. That's just right there. Sort of indicating the position. Guiding us in, luring us in. Hmm. I gotta find a way to get energy back first. That's for sure. Well, don't need these anymore. Hmm. But I used to gain back energy. Well, I could use. These guys as test dummies. Out here. Hmm. Come on, come on. Try this out. And let's go like this. Cool. Not much in the way of damage, but that's not the point. You just need. Thanks. And. Oh, well. I didn't think that knocked me back, but it did. Cool. And. Alright. Thanks. And. I'm gonna keep on electro particling it up. Ooh, nice. And there we have it. So that means dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay, cool. Let's go back to that one then. Oh, so this is actually the southernmost point on the mainland, but of course, Surumi is the southernmost period, and easternmost period is probably this island. Araumi Ruins. The rest does not get shown. Thought they added some, but it wasn't enough, frankly. Eh, it's not as confusing as Samaru, so they probably didn't see a need. Let's go back here and be that agent. The fact that you can only get... One achievement at the time is still pretty annoying. Okay. Let's get this started. Hello there. Moloshko. Oh, please. And. Stay out of the way. And. Dodge. Thanks. Okay. And. Blast you there. And. Get the mark. Mark's gonna help. A lot, too. And will that. Okay. Kinda, kinda. And there we go. Do this. Good damage. One end. Out of the way of that. Thanks. And good luck. And okay. Just make sure you don't hit that. If you can avoid it. And okay, thanks. Uh, oh, please. Come on. And. Okay. And here I got that back, which is good for me, but. Oh, come on. Well, observation. And it's, it's that one. Okay. Come on. And. Thanks. We need to. Shoot, and there we are, cool. We got stunned successfully. And over there. Cool. Blast, and... Uh, he's gonna go in too. 
Good stuff. Okay. Plus. Plus you and sit. Get and. Oh, come on. You don't want you to. Uh, charge back up, but. Uh, oh, healing is top. Okay, cool. And let's put this down and totally miss you, I guess. And annoying. Thanks. And. Well, not if that misses and whiffs too. Okay. There you are, and dodge. Okay. Come on, come on. All right. Thanks. Dodge that, and that that did not quite work. Sad. I, ooh. We still have Qs there, and which one? It's that one over that way, and come on. I. Such a cool fight. Okay. And here's the real body. I'll blow up. And like that. Get back up and cool. Charge up the burst. And cool. This. Nice. Gotta love it. Okay. Mm -mm. No space left. Right, we gotta feed Sethos. Number of drops is just crazy. It's not like I really need those swords anymore. But if I did, that'd be great. Okay. And... Ooh! They got crit damage. They've got to have some level of course correction, don't they? I feel like it. Eh, uh, maybe not. Alright. Okay. Snake visual knife. Cool. Couple of owl feathers. Well, all right then. Let's put these out for fun. Yeah, but the fact that he comes back means that at least that guy is not dying when we feed him. Hmm. During the course of completing a single challenge, defeat no targets besides the original body while Balasha was using Shadow Blade tactics. Three, three copies in a row before he can unleash Shadow Blade tactics. Interesting. That. You don't have to get that done once. You don't have to do it every time he tries it. What I'm wondering is that. Also, Safo is a her, not a he. Her namesake is literally the most famous lesbian in history, too. Also, you have another local legend around here somewhere, too. I think I might actually want to try that now. Maybe. Hmm. Question is how I'll find it. And it's somewhere with that over there, I believe. I wonder if it'll drop anything. I thought this might have been prepping for a boss next patch. It's not. Oh, hi there. Hello. You know, let's handle it like this. And cool. And... Oh, nice. It's too easy. This and the Arlecchino team. So probably my best options, period. Here, I believe. Something interesting will spawn. Hmm. I... Try this one out, maybe. Honestly, sure. Full pirate team. And we need to blow up all of these if I recall correctly. And, oh, hello. Huh. Just keep blasting. Come on. Oh, I could. Right. I may as well use properties. Epic winning moment. Oh my goodness. Well, okay. Damage is not increased right now, I believe, because, well. 
Gotta gain that back. So. Blast those. Blast that. And. No enemy? Okay. Huh. Not yet, at least. Oh, and there we go. Siho. Spirit sent from clouds above. Alright. Well. Okay. Oh, you're strong too. Oh, oh please. Mm, it's in slow, but main thing is avoiding the attacks. But I really wanted to blow up these up. What? Okay. Huh. This is going to be interesting then. You've got funky mechanics too. I. Right. Oh, come on. Come on. I And you got to dodge that. I will come back in a minute. Stay pretty still here. Mm -hmm. But every time it gets hit, no matter how weak or strong they hit, it gains a rage stack and eventually a shield. Yeah. And every single hit. So one of the achievements is beating it without procking its shield, which means you need to deal a rather small number of hits. And I'm pretty sure that Milani is one of the best ways to do that. Mm -hmm. I'd actually want to try using Sack of Jade. Well, actually, no, because her crit damage without Witsa is not all that special. The entire point is that she doesn't need Sack Jade. Point of how I've built her, well, shield's gonna happen. Regardless of what I do, so we'll just we'll just take it. Thank you, and bless. We will content ourselves with the shield being what it is. Thank you, and ooh, okay. Thanks, and hit, and oh, there we go. We got a bit of backlash. Miss Yellowway, and all right, cool. Pull that up, and oh goodness. So staying away is the best way to break that shield. That not, ooh, you are fighting just like that electro hypostasis. You're shooting stuff at me. Great. All right. And what? Oh, we were too close. Oh wow. Huh. I just this is crazy, crazy. But. Uh, are you taking any more damage now, or...? I can't tell. Hmm. Well, that... You are just crazy. Crazy, crazy. Huh. Feels if... Maybe... Destroy Milani anyway. Hmm. Already built around I'm just boosting her damage as far as I can at the moment right now. Well, Xing Chao would presumably also. That would count as hits too, I think. Hmm. Oh, there to boost. Her. Normal levels by one. That could actually do something. Hmm. Shield will be good for additional res shred. Yeah. Hmm. Emotional support. Let's see how this works. Hmm. Okay. It might. Might not. Probably won't. I'm gonna see if it drops anything. It'd be fun if it drops story and drops. It is a reptile. But popping that shield's gonna be a whole other story, though. Mm -mm. Make sure this stays far away. Okay. And then we do it just like this. One, two, three, fight! Ooh. Oh, application. We are in a 
weird position. And there we are. Cool. Mm -hmm. It's definitely the most efficient way to do it. But... I would say that, honestly, Dio would be a good way to get this done, too. Well, presumably. Come on. Oh, yeah, and then probably boost up as well. Yeah, for the Night Soul, that's what's going. Mm -hmm. With more levels of other things, I could see this working, but... Uh, the less comes out of the range, the better, so I... Oh, well, okay. Come on. Thanks. Just gonna want to stand out of the way when that happens, so... Oh, didn't want me to do that. Okay, cool. And... Try and We can eat that for breakfast. Good. And, okay. Oh, well, never mind. Ah. It... Dio would boost the value, but have to be very specific about how I use things. Hmm. Might have to be the way. But her, yeah, that means vaporize damage by actually Movable amount, so it's a little more than two hits. Actively. The main thing is to make sure that you have You're trying to minimize the number of hits dealt. What you want is... Even though the base damage of Vaporized Hadro and Paru is 2x, you really need... And it needs to be more than 2 hits, otherwise D is having no real effect. Basically zero. Okay. So, just like this. Cool, and... One, two, three, hit, and okay, nice. Two, three, right, and okay, cool. Mm -mm. Alright then. Try this again. And now we can actually. Oh, wow, well, we lost that. Mm -mm. That hit was actually basically wasted then. Okay. Hit, and. Milani. Two, three. Right and two, three, right and one, two, three, right, one, two. Oh, is that? Oh, it does not appear as if it's counting hits dealt from the fire as her own hits. We may be in business. Maybe. Definitely could do it with a few more levels here. Mm -mm. Okay. Come on, then. And just like this. Thank you. Morning. And smack. Two, three. Smack. And well, actually, stick with that. And there we go. One, two, three. Right. Oh, one, two. Oh, well, never mind. This is good, but for this to really, really work, we need a more skilled. Milani. But Milani is definitely the way we're going to supposed to do this fight. And that's pretty undeniable. Two, three, right, and oh, okay. Two, three, right, one, two, three, right, and alright, cool. Mm. Get her about half and taking Milani's skills up. Wooden. Oh, that's right, because it's skill level. That doesn't make any difference. So healer would be good then. Oh, uh, but... Barber's ring would probably count as hits for the sake of that. But... 
Oh no, we could try Xing Chao. Hmm. Well, alright. Try this. Come on, come on. Hit and that. Three. Die. One, three. Die. X. One, two, three. Die. Hit and. Oh, well, that was a waste of time. Whatever. We're gonna make this work if it's the last thing I can do. So the burst right is also a good idea. Okay, cool. Come on, just don't kill me and... Uh, we can feed her. Right. The kitty meal. And her. Okay, well, whatever. Come on, come on. Kachio really got hands. Okay. Thank you, and... Hit, and... Not a good amount of defense on you, like... Oh, come on. Please, please. That fire going. And... Okay. Dodge, dodge. Mmm, yeah, that's the damage she's taking. Come on. I, uh, avoiding this phase is the important thing. And with a fully leveled and skilled Milani, it would be trivial. But that's the thing. Come on. Come on, you... Uh, please, uh, okay. We need a... Okay, cool. And... There, well... That's gone. Okay. Hmm. Alright then. Alright. And, oh, okay, that actually made the difference. It's really fun, actually. Three and rage meter is not back up yet. Very good. And okay. Uh, crystallize being that close is bad for me. Come on. Keep on running. This surely doesn't help on a higher world level, but crazy how much this forced out of me. Okay, two, three, right, one, two, three, right, and okay, one. Let's hit, and cool, nice. We need to be very, very cautious about how we do this, but, you know, oh well, that's gone. Every pyro application needs to get used. That's the thing. Valuable things that I cannot afford to waste. Okay, right. Wrangle using Wits of Buffs more could actually be a better idea if I know what I'm doing. Come on, come on, come on. It's inside and. Mmm, that's gone. Okay. It's again. Please don't spin. You spin, I swear to God. It's one, two, three. And oh, you're kidding. Luckily, we can just use that to be fun, but I. Please, please. I hate you so much. We're finding out here. And... Remaining duration. Oh, that's bad. Come on up. Ooh, ooh. It's one of us for all the marbles. And finishes off with the... Elemental Burst. 1-8 HP at... Photo finish? <laughs> Milani, we will remember your sacrifice. And it's eight raw meat. Okay. That was really, really cool, though. Hmm. Oh, but honestly, best way to pair it then would probably be. A pyro bow user. Oh, no, but unless I want to be really, really silly and just let Night Soul expire, it's got to be, yeah. So I could take the fight comically slow if I just allowed DM1 to get her stuff like every single time. But no. Alright, that was interesting. Florida the Night.
How can restless thoughts be calm in this land? The only way is battle. Could get Velashka as final tomorrow, probably. It's an idea. I should probably heal up. Thank you for being useful, dear. Thank you very much. But some kind of Hajar healer would be good. If Xing Chao's swords don't count as hits, though they might, that would be the best way. Stacking shields and damage reduction, various kinds of damage reduction, just buff up a little, Melania a little, get her to just constantly vaporize. But if I want to get the final achievement, which is win without triggering the shield, I would need a very much, very much a stronger Milani. Before he forms the Thunderhorn Shield, yeah, exactly. Exactly. This one there, and I think... It's probably one about just not getting hit at all. Either way, even with a delay I've hit my time target. So I'm going to hop off. Thank you everyone, and Sanoragon.